First Blood.
Okay. All right, guys. Oh, and I didn't even set this up. Yeah, so I'm here with Digital. Uh, Digital's playing another game because he started way too early. <laughs> um, yeah, she she really she, did start uh, she... early, but oh well, I can easily swap games over. Like it's yeah. not good. Oh, right. So this, this is, is just a threat. A second here. Why is it not playing the sound for me? You guys can hear me, right? Yeah, it's showing, I don't know why, but I'm not getting the feedback of the notifications. It's not playing me the sounds for some reason. Hello, it's going all right. Hear you, hear the effects. Okay, good. I'm glad. Um, so... Yeah, I was trying to figure out who's going to be joining us, and we have five people on maybes, and most of those maybes didn't even respond to me. So I'm going to have to set up some new rules uh, for people who want to play tabletop sim, because I can't be learning how to play a game at the last second anymore. <laughs> I can't keep doing this. Driving me insane. Um, hey, Lear. Can, can you come online? Because I don't see you. Ah, shit. I'm probably invisible. I wonder why I'm not getting the notifications. Yeah, let me, um... Yeah, so in the Discord, the uh, the poll is no longer going to have a maybe. It's either you're either going to come or you're not. That's how it's going to be. Um, where is my game capture? There it is. Because, you know, of course, even the blurp is ghosting. What? I don't, I don't know. Oh, that is not... There it is. Okay, tabletop soon. So, I have been trying to learn the rules for Shovel Knight at the last second. Uh, so, I'm probably going to have to go through the book with Digital here. I kind of remember the rules, but it's been a while, right? And I've only played it once. I don't know why. I'm green. Oh, <laughs> green. No, because... Uh, oh, even the burp is ghosting, yeah. Yeah, I don't know why the... Uh, I'm not getting that feedback. That's weird. Because uh, that... Yeah, see, I, the RAR, I see that you got it, but I do not see, um, that's funny. Is this making noise? Yeah, no, the game works. Okay, the game's making noise. I don't know. It must be an audio issue. Uh, just one of the other million audio issues I have to fucking deal with. That's why the problem with <laughs> streaming is, like, there's a million things that go wrong all the same time, and, uh, almost all of them are audio, period. Um... I, audios are like the printers of the streaming world. They just don't fucking work half the time. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm going to go ahead and get started with just digital. Uh, it's just going to be me and digital for at least the first game. If people show up, we'll, they'll play. If not, then we'll you know, say fuck it. We'll just keep going. Um, so this is the Shovel Knight. It's by Panasaur's Game. Or not Panasaur's Game. It's by... Um, who the... Okay, note to developers, make sure you put the name of your company in your instruction booklet. Panda Cult. It's a Panda Cult game. Hiring an AV person is expensive. Yeah, it is expensive because it's like hiring a psychologist. Because you got to be specialized to deal with all the dumb bullshit that audio gives you. Um. Anyway, so this is the Shovel Knight board game. It is a semi-cooperative but mostly competitive uh, game. There will be a winner. Uh, digital, since you're the only one here, you get to pick a character, and I'm guessing you're going to go with green. <laughs> How did you know? I know, right? Oh, well, the other knights can fuck off. So, where's your seat at? Where'd you... Okay, that's not a... That... Mm... I, I'm going to need you to move seats, because I'm not rearranging the entire board for you to sit there. <laughs> you're going to have to it sit It is there. green, man. It is green. Uh, sorry, you're going to have to come over here, buddy. Um, the game it is pretty neat. It is an interesting game. It does play a lot like the actual board, uh, tip, the actual uh, video game. So do that, then join back in. Yeah, unfortunately, there is no automated one or one with a good board uh, that people have made. Uh, so it, when you, you didn't have to disconnect. You just switch teams. You can click on your name and switch team. <laughs> um. Okay, so uh, why don't you come over to this side where there's like literally Ow. nothing there? That would be useful. Be like, oh, digital, you want to play a board game? And she puts her damn chair in front of the dishwasher where all the dirty shit is in the sink and be like, all right, I'm ready to play. Like, what the fuck are you doing over there? Get your ass over here. How to <laughs> change jeans? Uh, you just click on your name and you just change color. 
and then you choose one of the colors down below. I really wish there was uh, an automated setup for this because there's a lot of shit to set up. There you go. Okay, now you're good. So what you want you want to do? You're gonna go with red now. You can still do the green. Yeah, but since I'm on red side, I'm doing red. I don't give a shit about your, your name color. I don't give a fuck about that. All right. Well, anyways, so you're gonna you're gonna have the red knight with both characters are the exact same. Okay, so you got red knight. I got your health right here. You can actually actually that should be five. Um, and then you get an enemy card. Unfortunately, it does not have the um the quick play stuff that a lot of games have for this setup on tabletop sim. But what you're going to do is you're going to take your character. You can place them in any of these four squares. You can even be in my square if you want. That's fine. It doesn't matter. But I'll explain the game as we kind of go through. There's some things I've been trying to keep up on, but there's a lot of other stuff we got to have a discussion on first, okay? So um, you also get three coins. So I will hand you your three coins. There's one, two, three. You have three coins to start with. Uh, coins are used for buying things. The way the game works is I believe whoever has the most coins at the end of the game is the winner. All right? Um, not even going to lie, this game looks a little complicated. It's Honestly, it's, once you get into it, it's not complicated like at all. It really isn't. It's uh, just once you get the mechanics, it looks complicated because there's just a lot of crap and the board is they gave the table they use is really small. We're going to drive into 40k tabletop sim for a night. Absolutely never. No, never. You, 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 you should feel bad for saying that. Nope. Absolutely not. <laughs> nope. 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 Um, so as you play the game digital, there's going to be uh, four types 40k sit it would be cool. Um I don't I don't know if I have the patience for that. I have trouble playing 40k on uh tabletop sim too. It doesn't I don't know, it doesn't feel right. Anyways, uh other games aside. Um so in your you have underneath your character you have uh three slots here. You got two accessories and an armor slot, right? So for your uh, what was it? I think it's shit. See now I gotta look it up. The video I watched was kind of stupid and how they they didn't go through the books side by side. They're just like, here's this. Now we're gonna jump to this thing over here. I think you okay. So I think you can have. I think the accessories and the powders can be in your accessory slots. I don't remember if you can double up on them. I have the Kickstarter book, and they do change a little bit. Should be a lot more on page 23. Let me switch to page 23. I do try to read up on games and stuff before we play, but since I literally had no clue what game we were playing until an hour ago, because I didn't know who was actually going to show up, um, makes it a lot harder on me. On top of, okay, so you can have it like this. Yes, Ruby, we did. You're the only one I've ever played this with. I've been trying to play this forever, and every time I bring it up, people are like, let's play Sentinels. I'm like, oh, uh, uh, all right. <laughs> we'll play Sentinels. Or we have too many people playing, or nobody. So, um, Oh, in uh, Interius, I, I am, I'm actually a crazy fan. I, I actually have like 10 armies, so... I'm kind of a big Warhammer player. <laughs> so in your accessory slots, you can have accessories, powders, or you can have a powder on top of accessory. Okay. So you can, but you can't have like two powders or two accessories in a slot. It's either accessory and a powder or just an accessory or just a powder in each slot. Okay. Because these usually like uh, help add stuff to it same with the armor so with armor you have you have your armor slot but you can also put a cloak on top of your armor as well um pretty awesome though I haven't finished my first armor. yeah I've, I've played it for quite some time i've been in a few tournaments and stuff too and it's and a painting contest but i haven't played in a long time i still have my armies are actually sitting i can see them from here they're over in the case but see you can stack these like this so you can see both effects okay now, the way you get these is from the shop, which is actually up here. The shop always has three cards available to buy. 
And the way you get the shop is you have to find the merch on the board. Like this guy here, that's the merchant. Okay. Um, you know what? I actually screwed up the shop. Hang on. Come on, tabletop, Sam. Get your shit together. Let me let me actually do this. <laughs> I also hate that there's no music. There. Okay, so we have the shop. All right. The way you get coins is uh, from playing the game, from defeating enemies. You'll see uh, next to your your screen, your thing here, digital. You have all the information for the enemies. Uh, quieter stream. Yeah, seriously. Uh, so mm -hmm. you have how much health the enemy has, the shovels are how much damage they do, shields are their defense, and the coins are how much money you get from them. It also indicates what their uh, attacks are, like melee range, etc. Uh, the hover, the hover haft, and the liquid samurai are a lot more, are much more difficult. Which unfortunately, when I did the full original pull for this, we get a bunch of those. So that's great. Also, wish we had 3D models. I have the 3D model version. Uh, underneath these piles as well, as you go through, uh, these will have stuff for you. If, as you're moving through the board, if there's coins or whatever sitting on the board, just moving over the space will allow you to pick it up. Okay, you don't actually have to do an active action to pick that up. Um, same thing with the, the pit. The, uh, the actual models are nice. Yes, they are. But even with the, so with the dirt mounds too, if you move over them, you automatically will pick them pick them up you just flip them over and you get whatever is on the side of them okay now as we play through and we move on uh, at the end of each turn the board is going to move so just like uh, a, a normal like side scrolling game it moves from left to right we always have to be moving to the right the board will automatically change so if we're on the left here and we get pushed off we'll we'll, we'll take a, a shitload of negative stuff so we don't want that so you always got to be pushing to the right okay the goal is to try to get as much shit and as many coins and things as you can uh, to beat out the other player. Because once you're done, you have to go into a boss fight, which I've already picked the the King Knight as our first boss. He's kind of the easiest to play, and he's the tutorial boss. Okay. Over here, we have different decks that give different things. When you get any of these items over here, like the loot cards or the relics or whatever, there's two options for these. You can either have them have like for example this loot card here you can have it where it's it's face down where you can use this um looks a little better than the one we got um i don't know well yeah we have more spikes when we did it um so the bottom here you can use this pretty much anytime so discard to gain plus two successes on the next dice roll but you have to um, you have to use that before you roll. You cannot roll and then say, oh, I want to use this. You can't, can't do that. It has to be before the person rolls. Same with this. Discard to force a rival player to re-roll their, la their last dice roll. So that one they have to have rolled, and then you can use it. All right? Spawn, that's how we're going to spawn enemies. Every skull on the board will spawn an enemy. You always start from top to bottom. Uh, these are the cards. That, that's what they look like. There's also heirlooms that give you special bonuses and arcana that give you special bonuses. We'll see how it goes because it can change drastically. Absolutely. So you have five health, three attack, uh, two defense, and two jump on your character as just the Shovel Knight. There are other characters to play as, but for right now, we're just going to play as the Shovel Knight. It's the easiest to play as. Okay. Now, now that the game's all set up. Um, as far as gameplay is concerned, there's three phases. You have the hero phase, the enemy phase, and then you have what's called the end phase. So for the hero phase, you have uh, you have a bunch of different actions you can turn, but you could take you could take three actions. There's movement, there's attack, there's jump, and stand up. Stand up as if you get knocked over from an enemy. Okay. You say you get three of those for turn? You get to choose to do three of those. You can do three movement, three attacks, uh -huh. whatever. A combination of three, but those are the four actions you get. When you move, you can only move up, down, left, and right. You cannot move diagonally in this game. 
okay? You also cannot move yourself onto a spike pit willingly. Spike pits kill you instantly, and you drop loot onto the spike pit for other players to collect. So how will I collect this dirt mound, then? That's one of the actions. I will get to that, yes. That is a good question. We will be doing that a lot. Uh, did you, I don't know. if Have you ever played Shovel Knight? No. Wonderful game. If you like old school NES games, it is magnificent. One of the best. Absolutely. Um, Hell yeah. Highly recommend it. Highly recommend it. Not even if it's on sale. Like, it's a great game. A lot of DLC for it, too. So as for an attack, now on, on each one of these squares, there can only be four models at a time. If there's four models, you cannot move into that square. It's in, You cannot do that. Um... You can also you can also not attack another player directly. You can knock them out of the way, but you cannot hurt them. But that being said, you can, you know, quote unquote, accidentally knock them into a spike pit or into a group of enemies or whatever. Okay. So, and actually digital, I don't know if you're curious, but I do have the rule book up here if you ever want to look at something. Okay. I forgot to tell you about that if you want to go through it as well. Um, when you do an attack action, you have to choose enemy, boss, arrival knight, attack, blah, 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 attack arrival knight, yada, yada, yada. Uh, is against the code of chivalry to wound an other knight. A knight must declare which enemy they want to attack. If it's a melee attack, they need to be in the same space as the enemy. If it's a ranged attack, the enemy must be in the same space or in a space along a straight line to the attacking knight. Now, for the most part, we're going to be doing melee um, you can get ranged if you get the right cards, but uh, our characters are melee focused. Um, then, what you're going to do, I'm going to give you these dice here. This is your set of dice. That's what you're going to use um, uh, when you make your actions. So, what you're going to do with so with these coins here, or with these here, when you do an action like attack or jump. That's how many dice you get. All right. So, for example, the let's say you wanted to do an attack action, you get two dice. All right. On these dice, you will see they have arrows. Wait, wouldn't it be three since it's attack? It's three. oh yeah, sorry, it would be three. Yep, yeah, I'm sorry. I was looking at the jump. I'm already jumping ahead. So what you'll do is you'll roll the three dice. You'll have different ones. So you'll have. <laughs> We're done playing with the dice I'm using. <laughs> Okay, I, I will show you what, what's going on on these dice that you're not fucking with. Takes the dice the ones away. Oh my gosh. If, you know what? If... Done. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, that was a good game. <laughs> no, no, right. Okay, so on these, you have the up arrows. Those are successful jumps. Armor is successful defense, and shovels are successful attacks. Okay, they come in different combinations from one to two. All right. Uh, when okay. you, yeah, it's it's pretty standard, which you might think. So basically, you need to get more attacks than what the enemy's defense says. Okay. Um. The loot cards will give you bonuses and all that fun stuff. Well, the dice and counts the number of shovel symbols. You saw it represents one one hit. Uh, from the total number of hits. Uh, and then uh, what? You know, you just put the wounds based off of how much is left over. So if you got like, let's say you're attacking uh, the bone clang, right? And you got two shovels. Well, he has zero zero shields, so you would do two damage to it, which would kill it. But if you did to say the hover shaft, well, you have to. It it takes away one, so he only takes one damage instead. Um, also, these guys are assholes because they push you back. So I don't get this one. Which one? Oh, why does he look so different on his card than he does on? Uh, that's because that's probably their, their art piece from in the actual game, the video game. This is their pixelated version down here. Ah. Because this is actually how they look in the game. Because it's like an old Nintendo game. Nah. Um, I can't wait to actually get this part to start. 
Yeah, pretty, pretty straightforward. Now jumping, jumping is important. So when you do a jump action, all right, um, let's see, multiple space under the agent. How do you know the results are showing jump in the two successes? They can successfully, okay, hang on. During the game, knights may find themselves next to a spike pit or other hazards. They need to perform a jump action to get across to avoid being defeated. Knights may jump over multiple spaces in a single jump action, and they can either jump in a straight line or potentially in an L shape. So that's how you would get over there. You would just, you could jump straight across or in an L shape. But we'll kill have fun. It's a fun little game once you go through it. Yeah, uh, Ruby had a great time with it. Um, it's just I've, I've only played it once, and it was uh, a while ago. Number one, jump symbols need six success fee. So the way jumping essentially works, you can, if you wanted to jump from here to here, you can. What you would do is you would, dedic you would say, okay, I want to jump to this square right here. Okay, then you count up one, two, three. That's three. That means you got to get three successes on the on the die. Now your jump stat is two, so you get two dice. Okay, you have to get three up arrows on two dice to successfully do it. Otherwise, you go nowhere. Um, more spaces than the night. No, a new car or dice roll contains at least as many jump symbols. If the knight does not roll enough jump symbols to successfully jump, then jump action fail, and the knight falls into spike pit and is instantly defeated. Yes, and when you die, uh, you pick up all. Oh, no, 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 no. oh, when you jump over the spike pits, that's how you just automatically pick up the mountains, by the way. Um, let's see. When, let's talk about when you get defeated. I believe you drop. Is it all your loot? If I can find the page, they don't have, a lot of times with these Kickstarter books, they don't have things very well indicated. Okay, and defeat, when this knight is defeated, the model's removed from the board. Half of that knight's coin tokens rounded down are left on the space. Um... Then they get, then you get to draw a loot card from the deck of your choice. On your neck on your turn, you may respawn back onto the board on any non-hazard space on the leftmost tile. If there are no safe space on the leftmost tile, spawn the next tile that has safe space. Okay. Um, if you get knocked down, you have to spend a whole action just to stand back up. But loot is automatically picked up as you go through. Um mm -hmm. you can use any amount of loot loot cards during your turn as a free action. Um, they basically you just do what they say. Now again, it depends on how you have them equipped as well. Like you, you can have these cards face down, and but you can only use their face down option, right? Um, or their face up if you're using their face up side. You have to choose which side you want to use. Um, you can hold only three loot cards. So, so like these face up, these ones that they're like face face down cards, you can only have uh, three of them. Um, otherwise, you got to discard one. Uh, blah, 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 blah. We'll deal with that later. Blah, 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 blah. Cloak can be equipped on top of things. Okay, so enemy phase. So once we both go, then the enemies get their turn. Um, enemy is on the board activate during the enemy phase. All enemy models move first, then attempt to attack a knight. So all enemies with a melee model will move one adjacent space toward the closest knight model to get into the attack range. Uh, if they get, if they can get in that range, then they'll attack, of course. One space, pages in the attack range. Uh, enemies do not move. There's already if there's a top for which model's closest. Enemy moves toward the knight with the most coins. The tie remains. The enemy moves toward the knight that is higher in the turn order. Um, once enemies move, those in attack range of a knight will attack. Attack range for melee enemies is the same space as the knight they wish to attack. Attack range for enemies, such as the Wisdom, is an unlimited amount of space in a straight line. Okay. Depending, I kind of already explained that. Uh, some enemies can hover over pits and things, so they're not bothered by them. 
Uh, when the enemies have completed their turn, the end of round phase, leftmost tile is removed, and the tile track, any knight or any enemy on the tile is instantly defeated. Any coin or treasure tokens remaining are discarded. So if you get pushed off the board, any loot you drop is gone. You cannot regain it. No one can take it. And the enemies are dead. Nobody gets them. Um, Swan point round is over. Start with a new hero phase. Okay. So, Spike Pith, Bomb Points, Chester, that's the, the one guy. Um, uh, I think that's kind of it in terms of the Precursor shit. Um, uh, I just to use any of those. So, you, and you can't expect to get defeated. It does, uh, happen. We, I think Ruby and I, when we play, we die a lot because we failed rolls. Um... But yeah, that's basically the game. And you just go through until you run out of tiles, and then you go, you have to make it all the way to the rightmost tile, then off the board. And then uh, you start the boss phasing up. And I'll do, I know the boss is pretty easy to like explain how that works. So, okay. Um, let me see if there's anything. Purchase. Oh, let me talk about the shop really quick. Okay, so on the shop. If you are on, uh, if you're on the spout spot with the merchant, you can purchase. All right, that's an action. Each additional equipment card purchase requires the use of one action. So if you want to buy three things, you have to spend three. Um, so what is the merchant? That's this dude sticking out of the chest right here. Ah. Okay. Now I want you to know this is not the board that's coming next. It's flipped upside down. This is the back side of the board. We do not actually know what's coming next. Because uh, they're, they're two-sided. Um, spends one action, one coin to purchase. So, equipment card price is based on how many equipment cards your knight currently has. If your knight doesn't have any equipment cards, it costs one coin for your first card. If you have one equipment card, it costs two. If you have three, then it's three, etc. Okay. Um... You can discard old equipment to put new equipment. Special all knights have a special action list on the Oh, that's right. There is a spa special action. So on your card, you have a special move called Strike the Earth. Okay. At least for Shovel Knight. Uh Pershing uh words that. All knights have a special action list on their hero card. All special actions have a coin cost that is required to be spent to perform the action. So for example, roll a cascading attack on an enemy in your space. If you cause it when you make move one space and continue, choose to continue the cascading attack. So essentially, if you do damage on the enemy, you can continue to attack. Right, let me let me double check cascading. Cascading attack is a special bouncing attack. When you perform this attack, you you and you successfully wound the target, you may continue the cascading by rolling an additional attack at minus one on a target in the same space. This may continue until the attack fails or you run out of dice. If you fail to wound a target, you are knocked down unless it is a ranged cascading attack. Okay? So, what that basically means, Digital, is if, let's say I was here, right? And I'm like, I'm going to use a cascading attack. I would spend a coin up. I would roll my three dice and try to wound one of these two targets. Okay? I would, you have to pick which target you're going to attack. If I wound them, I then get two dice that I roll to try to do another tag. If I get a wound on them, I get one dice to do a, try to do another wound on, on them. So you could do multiple attacks in one turn for a coin. But if you fail, you will fall on your ass and you'll have to spend an action to get back up. Okay? So it, it's kind of nice because it can't clear out some shit, but at the same time, it can be a pain in the ass too. Um... I just don't like these fan guys. The fan guys at the start of the their at their turn um, pushes hero in row back once in row. Okay, so it's in the row that they're in. In row, yeah, it's in their row. Moves two spaces per turn, ignores obstacles. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and get started now, digital. And I'll if you have questions as we go through, well, I'll answer them as best I can. So I'm gonna go ahead and go first. 
Uh, the rules say that whoever played Shovel Knight, Shovel Knight last goes first. I'm pretty sure that's me, but I'm going to go first anyways, just to kind of give you an idea of how a round goes. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go ahead and move into here. That's my first action. So for my second action, uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and I have to spend an action to get up. Yes, exactly. I'm going to spend a coin. I'm going to do a cascading attack on these guys because there's two of them. I want to try to kill both of them. So I'm going to take these th the three dice. I'm going to roll them. So I've got two. Oh, I, sh I was supposed to uh, choose which one I wanted to attack first. Probably going to get rid of the Wisdom because he's a bitch. So Wisdom has zero armor. So I have one, two, uh, three, and four. So I did four damage to him, uh, which kills him. So I go ahead and take him off the board. And I get three coins for that because I killed him. Now, because um, I can just put these in my hand, can't I? Yeah, that's, that's fine. So because uh, I did a wound, I get to continue with my casting attack. So I, but I get minus one die. So I'm going to do this again, and I'm going to try to target the uh, whatever the thing that flying rat thing. Flying rat, I got two shovels, and he has what? Um, oh, he has none, so he's dead. So he dies, and I get. Uh, one coin for that. Think. Okay, and basically I'm going to end my cascading. I'm not going to continue because if I continue, I'm just going to fall on my ass because there's no enemies to attack. Um, man, I don't like... I don't like some of these. I guess I could... How much is the hovercraft? He has more damn health. Uh, I'm going to use my second action to move up into this space. I get this this loot here, which is one gem, so it's one coin. So I get another coin. I mean, you messed up the board already. Uh, they should snap back in. Do they not? Yeah, there it is. Um, should I do another cascading? Um. Yeah, I got the money. I'm gonna go ahead and do spend another coin for. Ca I'm gonna do another cascading move. And I'm gonna try to kill this. I messed that up. I know, Roby. Leave me alone. And four. Thank God. So he takes three damage. I'm a. I'm going to hit him again and try to kill him with two. I just need two shovels. And I got it. All right. So he dies. So I get four for that. Okay. All right. Now, that would end my turn because that's all three of my actions. I can't do nothing else. I'm done. So now we'll move to you, uh, Digital. That was actually a very... Never leave Condor. No, no, leave me alone. Uh, that was actually a very lucky roll because I actually made my damn attacks. Um, I've had that go extremely badly. I was very lucky. Shovel Knight board game. Yeah, this is by Panda Cult Games. Uh, a little background on Panda Cult Games. I've actually just talked to their developers in person multiple times at Gen Con. They're great people. Um, I bought this game actually just because they were really cool and they gave me some bonus discounts and shit. Um, they make the cult, uh, the Barnacle Bay, uh, was it Cult of Barnacle Bay uh, board game, which I want to play on Tabletop Sim with some people sometime. It's like Massive Darkness, but with furries. Uh, better rolls than we had. Yeah, no, that was very good. I know, I'm not going to lie. I was, I was super lucky. Okay, so Okay, so first action you're gonna move, alright. Second now that's two actions. So uh you can now take this token here. Oh. Wow. Here. Go ahead and flip it over with F. 
Uh, so chess, I think that's how you get the loot cards on the side. Um, damn it. Where is your... There you go. Huh? Oh. Oh, well, there you go. Uh, yeah, you just get a loot. So you get, I think you get the pick. You, you can have any from any of these four. Why did blood? Oh, blood messing up too. Yeah, we're all messing up. Oh, it's off. It's, it's, I don't know. So you may, um, I mean, you can flip that over and look at the other side. You don't have to have it in your hand. So that there is a uh, range item. So that just kind of goes off to the side. You can just use that whenever you want. But you get to choose if you want to face up or face down. Okay. Face up, you can use this side. Face down, you can use this side. Depends on what you want. All heroes are pushed. No, it does not. That's why I like the scripted ones better. So you want to use that side? Yep. Okay. All right, so that's uh, two actions. You still have one more action. I'm going to go ahead and discard it because I'm going to use the cascading attack. Okay. You get plus two successes automatically. Now, it's on your next dice roll, so it's going to be on this first one. Honestly, what I would do, Vigil, I would roll this first one where you have three dice, and when you go down to two, then use that. Ah, okay. Okay? Because then it's guaranteed. Uh, actually, before you roll them, which one are you attacking? The Liquid Samurai or the uh, Hover Hover. Sh Hover Haft? Okay. Hover. If you, um, okay, so you got one, okay, so you got two shovels, you're ta and you're attacking the hover, so the hover takes one damage. Okay, so that's successful, so that means one die goes away, so now you have these two. Okay, so are you going to use this? Yes. So you just discard it, you can just put it, like, right there or whatever, um, just put somewhere, we, ah, eh, we could, I'll just put discard down here. Uh, so you already have two successes, so go ahead and roll those two dice and see how many you add to it. Uh, here, watch, watch. Yeah, there you go. Just tap R rapidly. There you go. Mess up by proxy. So three, four, five. You got six successes. You can only defend one. He's dead. He's like ultra dead. So you get. You can pull four coins. EMOTIONAL DAMAGE! Does it not show you the coins in your hand? They only hit, it's only question marks? Because you're supposed to be able to see how much loot people have. That's lame. I guess I can't do that then. Yeah, so just put them somewhere, wherever you want, as long as you can have access to them. More players, emotional damage. It didn't say nothing. Why is it did not gaming double? Why is it not letting me add these other ones to it? It's probably because it's being stupid. Audio discard avatar Twitch live blurbs. Yeah, the blurbs are Let's see properties. Advanced out and blurb is active. Monitor and output, it should be. It might be because I had to reset and update my computer. Stream broken. Yeah, uh, oh, wow. Fuck you, Ruby. This is confusing. Yeah, it won't let me add these at that's, all. It's only Lynn. That's fine. Don't worry about it too much. All right, so the first one's dead. You still have another dice roll if you want to try with one, or you can choose to stop. I stop. Okay, so if you're going to stop there, um, that was your third turn. Um, so, that being said, I'm going to move these eyes out of the way here. Uh, it's going to be the enemy's turn at this point. So, enemies. Now, first of all, uh, the hover, hover halves, they have their ability to push heroes in row back one space. Well, the, all the ones in our row are dead, so we don't have to worry about them. We can put that back into there. Um, no fucking at FC. Wow, Ruby. Damn. I mean, I'm not going to anyways, but, you know, damn. 
So next we go to the Liquid Knights. So they're going to move uh, a space towards towards a character. Um, yours is not. Yours is going to straight up attack you. So he has two attacks. Uh, where did my book go? Let me double check and see. I think do they? I don't think they get two attacks. I think you have to roll two defenses against them. Pretty sure you have to roll two defenses. I think it's you get two dice and you have to roll two armors to defend against the liquid samurai. Oh, he moves two spaces. Well, fuck me too, I guess. Uh, reroll that one. This one stays. Reroll that one. Uh, this one says it's on the armor times two. Uh, no, on my screen is it's on its edge. That doesn't count. You have to reroll oh. it. Well, no, I go on over the mouse that told me what it landed on. Mm, I'd rather go from visual. Okay. So you'll take one damage. But then I gotta take my stuff here. Yeah, I guess if we're going... I don't know, that's kind of a hard thing because I... With board games, I go by the act, the the tabletop rules of if the dice is cocked or are angled like that, you have to re-roll it no matter what it says. I guess it's kind of weird because it does tell you, so I don't know. I am okay. But these guys also get to move. They just move one. So they're going to move here and here because that's the closest they can get. They can't do nothing else. So that'll end their turn. This is going to move down. This is going to move down. This is going to move down. This is going to come off. And move there. And now, the way it works is we with this new board, I take treasure rounds and I put it in the opposite spots, like this. There's no skulls anywhere, so I don't have to put enemies. All right? Uh, and that's it, and we start a new round. Okay. Um, I'm with the enemy, so I'm going to just go right ahead, find the game, even let it land on it. I know, I don't know why it must have glitched out. It was weird. Um, I'm going to go ahead and attack Samurai. And he has, wait, what the fuck? Get there. Three health, huh? Should I do cascading? Fuck it. We'll do cascading. Cascading, cascading, cascading. He has no defense, so as long as I get one shovel, I'm good. Uh, so he takes one damage. That's not as much as I was hoping for. I need two more shovels. That'll do. Okay, and he gives me how much? Four? So I'll take the four. Uh, take him off the board. He's dead. Okay. Um, I'm going to use my next action. I'm going to do a jump action to here. So I need to roll two uh, jumps on two dice. I hope I don't die. That would suck. For me, at least, it would suck. I die? <laughs> well, fuck. God damn it. So I fall on the spikes and die. I don't know how you lay over. Anyways. Uh, let me see how much stuff I have. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So round down. So I need six. Two, three, four, five, six. And that's now right there. And I think, I don't think I come back until next turn. Let's see. Well, that was my last move anyways. So, Digital, you can go ahead and do your turn. Go ahead and do the cascading. Okay. On the samurai. Samurai. Juicy title. It is very much a juicy title. 
tile. Uh, so you do two damage to him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I saw the two shovels. Why is defeat not its own goddamn page with its own title? And he is dead now. Okay, let's go ahead and take him off the board and uh, get your loots. Your fat loots. What the hell? Is there not even a goddamn index to def being defeated? No, that's shitty. There's a lot of ways to die in this game. It's kind of shitty that they don't have so, one a page dedicated to it. This will be my last move. Okay. Now, now remember, if you... Okay, oh, I see where you're at. Never mind. I was looking at it wrong. All right, before we go forward, let me find where the defeat is because it's not a dedicated section in this damn book. For some reason. Why it's not is just beyond me. Using a loot card. Stand up action, enemy phase. Because it's not even under the enemy phase, it's under like the jump action. Some shit. Nice to be it. There it is. It's on page 20. Half of that knight's tokens run down and left the space. Anytime a knight is defeated, the knight gets to draw one loot card from the deck of their choice. On their turn, they may respawn back onto the board. So it's on my turn. So I'm staying, I have to stay off the board until my turn comes up. But I get to choose a card. I take it, this means I get two silver. Did you? Yes, that's two silver. Um... Um, uh, I'll do a, I'll do an heirloom card. Are, are these all 11, 9, 9, 10, I'll do an heirloom card. Gyro boost, spin like a togging, two free move actions, push all models in your path this turn. Okay. Um, I think I'll keep that face up. I like that. Okay, so your turn's over. Mm -hmm. So these guys are going to move one space this way towards the nearest player. Nothing else happens. This moves down. We're starting to see the start of the king's worlds pop in. Um, Uh, okay, we got to put one there. So with this new tile set, the walls, you cannot move past the walls unless you have an item that lets you move past them. So you see this red mark here? You can't even jump over them. You have to go around them. And there's an enemy, so we're going to spawn an enemy, which is a skeleton. Wouldn't there be two enemies since there's another skeleton? Oh, is there? I didn't see that. Okay. So we're going to copy and paste. Copy and paste and ugh, ugh gross well i could take one of these put that and that all right jesus yeah there's all that's i mean there's a lot of enemies uh, i'm gonna put myself right there <laughs> then i'm gonna do a jump action to get over there gain two free move actions push all models in your path this turn i don't have any models in my path um all right, let's try this again. Oh God, come on, give me, two, give me two jumps, please. Please give me two jumps. That works, oh my God. So I'm gonna jump here. Uh, I get my money back. <laughs> Takes the whole oh, board. My, yeah, it's cause... Jeez. Jesus, okay. <laughs> get your shit back. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of like how how uh I... oh because these these are these shouldn't be there those should be off okay, that's why it's like that okay 
I get this. Uh, I think that's just that's just a straight up fiber. Okay. And I can use the shop. So I used one action to get there. So that means um, I can spend an action to spend one coin. Uh, I'm going to buy something from here. Plus one jump, plus one max one attack, max one, max one fire knight. I'm going to take the trench blade. Okay. Powder gain one plus one coins when defeating an enemy. When defeating an enemy, deal one wound to another enemy in the same space. Charge hand plus one attack. One plus one attack, max one per night. Uh, I'm gonna spend two for my final action to buy the charge handle. Then my accessory slot. Oh. Plus one range. Oh well, that would have been nice. Oh well. Um, and that's going to be the end of my turn. Uh, I'm about to get game banged. I'm not liking it. Uh, I mean, you can move out of that way. You can jump over them. You, you can move back if you want. Just remember that the samurai gets to move two spots. Also remember, right before uh, the enemies get to go, if anyone is in this these guys' row, it blows them back one space. Which Wait, could... can I jump over here? Uh-huh. Just do a jump action. So you got to roll uh, two ups. Which you failed. You die. So you get off the board, take half of your coins, round it down, and put them on the pit. Just like I did. Yeah, I gotta say, I'm not liking this game. Because <laughs> you lost half your shit? Hey, you can get it back. Provided I don't steal it. Which I might. Um, Alright, so that's your turn. Uh, enemy's turn. Nothing happens. Uh, samurai is going to move twice. Uh, can the samurai move? Ignores obstacles. So he can just move straight over spikes then. Yeah. So I'm the nearest player, so he's going to move there. Damn it. Uh, Hoverboy is going to move here. They're going to move here and here. Uh, this guy's going to move down. This guy's going to move down. Let me move. Right. Let me move one. Yeah. Uh, board's going to move down. Okay. We have one skull there, so we're going to pull a spawn card, which is just a knight. And then mounts, so we got one there. This one goes on here, and this one goes on here. Wait, that's... Where's the rest of the fucking board? Hold up. Where's the rest of the goddamn board? Really, game? You're not even gonna have the full fucking boards? I know there's more than just two boards for this. That's not it. Oh, I am. Uh, I'm extremely annoyed at this game now. Whoever set this up, they we don't have all the fucking boards. Like, how 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 do you screw that up? Hang on, let me think here for a second. Let me take this. Maybe it's under the tiles. That's what I'm. That's what I'm wondering. I don't think so because I thought I had it all set up. Yeah. Fuck. See, that's not it. But 
I don't even know what those are. That's it. That's all the tiles. They actually don't have all the right tiles. What the hell? That is no bueno. I'm very upset now. And so yeah, and I I threw the boards in here just to get them off the off the board, but all the rest in here is just the actual bosses. The other ones, what other ones? Like these? Oh, on the board? I don't think so. That's the air one. Let me ch I'll check them in a second. God damn it. Uh, tabletop sim. Sometimes I love you and sometimes I absolutely hate your existence. Are you telling me that's it? We going to the boss now? Uh, no, we should be a lot more than that. In fact, I even feel that the grasslands is a little short. No, on the board itself, under the other tiles you didn't check. Like these here and the, on the board? Oh. There they are. Oh, you moved the whole stack. I did, apparently. God damn it. So that's why scripted is better than this. Okay. Um, those two, let's move okay. this one out because that's not actually... Okay, so let me hang on. Okay. That's just one, right? Okay, three. Okay, okay. Put that there. Shuffle that. Those can just fuck off because we won't need those. Those can just go where the fuck ever. Um. Uh, I'm glad you mentioned that. All right. Well, okay. Maybe I'm not as angry as Honda I was. was about to have a fucking. I was. <laughs> I was absolutely about to have a goddamn aneurysm. It's like what the fuck? Who the fuck did this? Okay. So they all moved. Uh. Oh, I, I pulled enemies, so that should be there, actually. And that should be two samurai. Oh, man. Can we not get all the samurais? That'd be great. All right. Okay, now. I have a feeling grab the stack. I'm glad you had that feeling, Ruby. I'm glad you were there to mention that. Unlike my moderator, Nether. <laughs> Ooh, Damn, never got uh, caught out. Called the fuck out. Um, all right. All right. I know I don't have him doing the hydrates. I'm not I'm not even drinking as much alcohol as I should be. Here, I'll hydrate for myself. Mm. All right. All right. Okay. Now. Enemies do their bullshit. Um. Oh, wait, no, no. We start, no, no. We start a new round. That's what we do. We start a new round. Uh, is there any way I can clear the equipment? Like, is that a thing I can do? I thought there was a way Hydrate. to clear the equipment. Or this is just a threat. It. Uh, so a nice equipment card. Equipment card. Blah 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 blah. Powder armor, cloak, special actions. No, I guess I can't. You have to go with what they give you. Um. Okay. So for my turn. Man, I'm... Oh, I'm not liking this shit at all. Deek! Okay, fine. I'll hydrate. Thank you, Ruby. Hmm. Hell hydrate. Oh, oh, shit. I am drinking peach vodka with natural flavors. Unmixed. Um, well, uh, I will spend... I have to spend three coins for this. So I'm going to spend three coins. And I'll take... Uh, I'll take this powder here. What's the tile? I don't... I'm not sure, actually. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. It might be a boss thing or something. I don't know exactly what that is. 
Here's a cloak. All right. One may move through. Cl yeah, okay. <laughs> Two, three. Uh, I'm going to spend four coins. Hydrate. Cloak. This is just a action. threat. And equip the cloak. Um. Digital. Okay, hang on. Mm. What? You what you mean what? Uh, you know what? Oh, I'm shit. sorry. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh. All right. You know why he's talking about stream? Because uh, I don't. What the fuck? <laughs> God damn it. Um. Uh, was that another cloak? Well, I can't have two cloaks, so I can't do anything about it. So I have one action Hydrate. left. Um, this is just a threat. Actually, I get two free move actions because of this. Hey. I see you there. Yeah, even though it doesn't, I don't hear it, I can see it, digital. <laughs> All right. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Okay. Hey, you were complaining about not getting enough drink, wasn't he, uh, guys? Singles? Yeah, yeah, I know. I regret it. Actually, I get two free movement actions with this. I really want to steal your stuff. <laughs> I don't know if I can move through. Well, I got... It's a movement, not jump. I don't know. Jump, I think I can jump over stuff. And then I can move. Oh. Let me... All right, I'm going to try to... I'm going to try to steal your shit. I'm going to try to steal your soap. God, God damn it, come on. There it goes. Jump. No! That's what you get, you greedy bastard. Yeah, fuck you. Be five, six, seven, eight, so f I get four. Giant <laughs> stuff on the poor wolfie. Totally worth it, though. <laughs> well, your turn, now, Wolfie. When we come back, don't we get to pick an item? Uh, you get. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, when you you do get to pick an item, and so do I, actually. Um. I'm gonna jump over to the shop, and I'm gonna use discard this to get two success force. Okay, hold up, hold up. First of all, you gotta put your character on the thing. Oh, yeah. Uh. So you're going to put yourself there? Can I put on spikes? No. You can't put on spikes. Because I'm trying to see how to get to the shop. Because you can't go diagonally. No, you... Okay, oh, when you jump, you can make an L shape. Oh, okay. Then you can you start here and go one, two, three. That's fine. It's... it's, Or you can go here and do one, two. Either way works. I'm gonna jump up to the shop. You're gonna use that. You don't even need to roll. It's an automatic with that. And that means I get all the loot. You get all that shit. Yep. Ah. Not that. I gotta lie, I wish this had a better system in it, like the the games. Uh, yeah, I, I almost wish these could be stacked. These should be a stackable thing. <sighs> really? Tabletop Sim, play, work with me here for five seconds. God damn it. Okay. Alright. So you get all your monies, and mine. Thank you. The one, two, the one, two step. I don't know what the one, two step is. Okay. Uh, so now that you're here, you've already spent an action. So you have two actions if you want to use them on the uh, the thing, the shop. Let's see. So your first item you can buy is worth one coin. You actually have some really good choices right now. I'm gonna go ahead and spend one coin. And get this. Okay, that goes in an accessory slot. Some dance move, apparently. Okay, there's your options. Now, if you're going to spend your second action, it's going to toss you two coins. I don't know if you have enough. Huh? 
I'm I'm joking. And it goes up by two. Yeah, so you have to spend two. Ah. Yeah. Oh. I just noticed something. I'm not gonna say it though. <laughs> I just know this is this uh this is gonna be interesting. Okay. So your turn's done. Oh, okay. Let's still put that down. No, no, yes. So, so this is something I just realized now they're our digital. So before the enemy phase goes, these guys go off. They push all player models in this row back one. You die. <laughs> and your loot drops right there. Oh, no, no, no. Not, not your equipment. You keep your equipment. That's forever. Your money. You, get, you take half of what you got, and it drops right there on that space. It's getting annoying with that <laughs> shit. How do people like this fucking game? I like this game. What are you talking? You just don't like the fact that you lost your money. <laughs> I hate to fucking hover people. Fucking kill them, <laughs> goddamn uh, fire. Yeah. <laughs> that's why you got to watch your position. But to be fair, yeah, it's like that's mm, that's a hard one. That so, should be like able to do a save on that shit. Nope, it, that's what they say. It says right there, pushes heroes in row back one space before the enemy phase. So the enemy phase happens, we're both dead, so they don't do anything. They just sit there. Hey, I like the game, and I sucked luck. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I think this is because they lost their money twice. I mean, I lost all my shit, too. <laughs> and here's the best part. Your money goes away because um, the tiles move. And push it off the board. Okay. There. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, god. Table top sim. Ah. Okay. Oh, there's no skulls on that one. But then we do get mounds. We were used to games being more forgiving, maybe. Uh, yeah. Oh, what? No, oh, shit. I, I put the coins in the wrong fucking bag. So there's your money's in the treasure mounds for some reason, on accident. Uh, so it's my turn. I'm going to put myself right there. I get two free move actions because of this. So, um... I'm going to move one... Uh, oh, I got a chest. Got a chest, chest you do. Yeah, uh, you know what? Let me pull a, um, pull a relic this time. Hydrate. This is just a threat. All right. I see what you're doing over there. Fly three spaces. Push all models in path. Fly three spaces. Can I? I should choose that. I'm guessing that's an action. Here, let me take that drink, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm trying again, a little bit tipsy over there. Oh, no, it takes a while for me to get tipsy. <laughs> okay, stream, what you need to do is everybody do drink. I'm not going to do that. If everyone does drink, I'm not going to do all the drink. You guys got to spread it out. Spread the love a little bit. That's how that goes. Because I can only drink so much alcohol at once. It's it's not my favorite thing to drink all the time. Oh boy. Um, okay, so using a loot card. Loot cards are unaffected by the equipment. Or may use any amount of loot cards. Some loot cards can be used after a knight has been attacked by an enemy. Use a loot card, read the text, a knight can hold up to three cards. 
So do you get rid of it after you use it? I'm guessing you would. Otherwise, that's broken as shit. Well, I, I use this one technically, so I'm going to... I'll put this one over here. Whatever. Um... So I get another free movement. So I'm going to move here. I'm actually going to push this guy here. And then... And because I have that cloak, I can go through this wall. That's why I did that. Um... You're going to risk it for the biscuit. Uh, well, I'm going to use my second one here. Fly three spaces, push all models in path. I'm just going to toss that over there. So I'm going to go one, two, three, and I get these uh, a loot item and two gold. What's that? Can be played out of turn, reflect an attack or relic card back to attacker. What's the other side of it? Discard to force rival player to re-roll. Um, I'll keep the re-rolls. I'll keep the, the fuck you part. I get two of these. And now I can actually do my turn. <laughs> I still have three actions. Um... I'm going to move one, move two to pick this up, and then use my final action to move here, and I'll end my turn. All right, Dijay, you're you are Gucci. You're up. Nice. Since I die, I get to... Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, claim. Yeah, that's a skeleton guy. Oh, nice. Yeah, let's keep it on his back. And I have to... any space that doesn't have a hazard. So here, here, or here. I want to say you can move past enemies. Let me double check how movement works. I don't think it says. It's a jump action. Attack action. So I lose on the most of the no remaining tiles left in this tile stack. Like me move out the board to the right side of the play area. Yeah, you could just, I guess you could just walk past enemies. Yeah. So you could actually start there and literally walk all the way to here if you wanted to. I mean, you would get jumped by these three, but I mean, it's an option. Just remember, you check where the walls are. Those are important. Because they do block enemy movement. Except for the knights, the, the, the samurai. Samurai just go through shit. They're special. And they're assholes. And they can move two spaces. Okay, so two act, two movement. Don't want you fucking samurai. Oh, you want the mount here? Let me help you. Ah, uh, Okay, got a chest. Oh, those are really good. Dash through dirt and foes alike. Fly two spaces. It's also attack four. So fly two spaces. Hit all enemies in path. All heroes in path are pushed. May move through walls. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh, you can wow. use that any time. It also means if you do an attack action while this is active, you get four. But um, it's not an equipment, though. It goes off to your side. It's and, a one-time use? Yeah, it's a one-time use. Pretty sure the loot cards are one-time uses. Otherwise, they'd be really broken. Yeah. I mean, it really needs to say... 
one time use. Uh, I agree. Yeah. I'm pretty sure they're one time use. If I find something that says otherwise, I'll, we'll change. But uh, I'm pretty sure they're one time use. That's one thing I don't like. Is this game is not really explaining. Oh wait, there it is. What? Did you find it? Yeah, using. I, a... Yeah, it doesn't say. Let me check the FAQ here. Hmm. Yeah, well, there's no FAQ. Let me do a Google search real quick. Um, uh, let's see. Loot. Yeah, no. say they really don't do good on explaining. Yeah, uh, I find that with a lot of Kickstarter games. Loot. Uh, how do loot cards work? That's one thing that, like, the game is fun, but just how they have it written is this, basically, is loosely written, in my opinion, on some of these. When an item pushes in at night, it always pushes itself left. Uh, loot cards. Loot card, discarded. Discard. Yeah, uh, how you. It's... Also, remember to put your health back to max, too, because you took that one damage. Oh, you can sacrifice a new, a new loot or relic to remove immediately remove a wound or status counter. I'm pretty sure you have to discard them. Uh, it only seems right considering you how many you get in the game. Okay, there we go. After using a loot card, the card is then discard next to the loot deck it came from. Okay, there you go. Yep, you found, found it. it. You found it. There it is. Why did they just put it all on one page side? Hey, this yeah. is how you use this side, then the other side. It's just like, be one uh, page just for loot card, one page for when you die. Yeah, I know. I don't know why they do that. You get this... like two pages that splits it in half between both of them. Mm hmm. Hmm. Uh, all right. So, yeah. So, you did what? Two actions there to move there? And then you looted your thing? So you still have one action left. Hmm. Should I go in suicide? Check it, I'm going in suicide. I mean, you don't really have a choice. <laughs> Unless you move up here, then they'll all just jump you. And You're by better... my click, since there's more than one enemy, so I get four dice in total. Are you going to try doing a cascading attack? Mm-hmm. Are you going to use this card as well or no? Uh, might save that for the boss. Okay. Um. So first, before you start, pick which enemy you are attacking out of those three. The golden armor. The golden armor guy. Okay, so he has one defense and four health. All right, go ahead and roll your four dice. Try to wound him. You need two shovels. Which you got, so he does, he takes one wound, and then you remove a die. Oh, I wish we need this click and send this deselects them all. Yeah, yeah. I usually click and drag to highlight them all. Three. So that uh, take away one. He has two health. So he has one more health left. Uh, 
Uh, you failed, so you fall over. Which doesn't really matter a whole lot. Uh, but the enemies are probably going to kick your ass. We'll just imagine that you fell over. Um, unfortunately, that's the end of your turn. Yeah. There was no way, good way out of that. <laughs> uh, enemy phase. So they're going to go off. These guys are going to move. Um, he can only move one. He's going to join this. Oh, no, he can't because there's only four. There's already four enemies. Um, so what's going to happen? Sam these two samurais are going to get their attacks off on you one at a time. So they have two damage. So roll your, what, uh, two defense dice? You need two armors. Uh, Reroll that one. Two armors. That is not two armors. You take two damage. Go ahead and do it again for the next samurai. Take two more damage. Uh, Fuck these dice. Do it again more, one more time for the golden knight. And you die. So same as before. Put this back up to five. You get a item from... Uh, not the spawn, but, you know, over here you get one of those items. Um, and half your, half your loot rounded down. I'm just moving them over here where it's just out of the way. Okay. See, they need to make it with it automatically slides onto the board, like a button. Yeah, uh, if it was automated, it would do that. Um, okay, so no enemies, so that's good. Uh, these were, I think, on the spikes, so that goes there and that goes there. Um, yeah, and it's the new round, so I go first. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I, don't, I just don't like these guys over here. I have anything I can really... It is like a shit ton of them. I know, and the problem is, is I mean... We're supposed to be competitive, so technically I should just let you enjoy the gauntlet of bullshit that has co uh, itself, uh, collected itself over there. <laughs> then I'm going to try to be nice. Um, I'm going to move one, move two. Uh, you know what? Actually, no, no, no. let's do this. I'm going to, I'm going to jump. I'm going to jump three. I'm going to try jumping three. I got it. So I'm going to jump right over to here. I'm going to take your money. I'm going to do cascading jumps as my second action. So I get plus one attack, so I actually get another die for that. Um... Okay, I'm going to start uh, with Chucklefuck, the Gold Knight. That is... Uh... Wow. I fall down. And my turn's over. Oh, no. I spent a turn to get up. That's it. That my turn's entirely over. And now I can't help you because there's four in there already. Yep. 
That is indeed true. Wow. I had four goddamn <laughs> dice and I got one fucking shovel. Is there a discard of force rival player? Force rival player. Plus one jump. Max for night. Well, I got I got one defense at least to help one more defense to help me out. So that's kinda nice, but yeah. Alright, your turn, I guess. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Told you the game can be ruthless. ruthless. I mean, the Solo Knight itself, uh, you know, can range from really hard to, you know, easy. But, yeah. That's how it is. All right. Moving in on in. So that's one, two. Three. Okay. Uh, that's it. That's all you Hydrate. can do. Hydrate. This is just a threat. What help, but uh, I can't do shit because it's massive no, no, it's... Hydrate. Thanks, Ruby. Oh. All right. Enemies move. One, two. Uh, go ahead and take your two damage from him. Or two attack. Bruh. Ow. One, two. Oh, I died, so. So. Oh, no, I didn't die. Oh, wait, shit. Hang on. Hold up, hold up. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yes, yes, you do. You do take that. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Do your damage. So you defended. You're good. Uh, I. This guy's going to move down. Um. And I'm going to have to defend up against a whole lot of bullshit. So I am good for the first samurai. Second samurai. I am not good. I take two damage. And then from the golden knight. I am good for the golden knight. All right. I'm all right. Um, I am not. All, oh, no. They can't move in there. So they would then move towards the other player. Okay. Uh, that's it. Uh, these guys are going to just get pushed off the board because they can't do nothing. Okay. Now we're at the last tile. <laughs> God damn it. All right, and we have one spawn, which is uh, a rat and a knight. So at this point, uh, digital, uh, since that's the last tile, you can actually move off the tile, off the board entirely. If you do, you're basically done until I get off the tile. Okay. You don't get any bonus for finishing early. All right. That being said, uh, it is my turn. What if I was to do one, two, three, four? What if I was to do a four jump? Actually, what do you have here? Nothing I can really use. Uh, can I pull a four jump off? At plus one jump, you have to get four up arrows. I'm not going to fucking do that. I'm not fucking going to do that. Uh, I'm just going to move one, two. Three. And I, I'll just end my turn there. Okay, Digital, you're up. I might die this turn. <laughs> Gonna fuck the Semurai up. Go for it. So, two damage. So he takes uh, both of them, I think, yeah. 
Uh, he's not dead, though. He has one health left. Uh, he is very dead. Uh, wait. No, he... Yes, he is, because he has no health. No armor. Yes, he is dead. So get your... Get your loots. Your fat loots. So you still have one more turn. One more action. Okay, and you get that mound. One whole dollar. Wow. And that is it. So enemies are going to go. One, two. Uh, one, two. One. 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 Fuck my life. All right, let me do my rolls. Uh, so this guy has two attack, so I need two armors. Got it. The rat boy has one. And I fail, so I take one damage. All right. Uh, new round. He gets pushed off. Okay. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm just going to, uh, ah, uh, should I try? I should try. Should try. I'm going to do my cascading jump. So I'll pay a coin. I get four dice against... I'm going to do the rat, actually, first. No. I should do... I should do the knight first. Knight first. Knight first. <sighs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. I fall down. I spend an action to move up. To get up. I move over. God damn it. I get a fucking loot thing. Um, uh, should I just do it? Yeah, I'm just going to discard. I want to discard my loot. I want to get a free move action. I'm just going to move off the board. <laughs> All right. I'm done. So to move off of the board, I just need to clear one jump or two jumps. Uh, technically, it's two because one, two. It'd be two spaces. Uh, so you fell in the pit and died. Whop. Ugh. Get tired of that shit. <laughs> yeah, the jumps are risky. Oh, that's right. That's still on. On this? No, he's dead. He's gone. Right? I think he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Uh, yeah. All right. Um, enemies can't move. Good news is you're going to have a chance of getting it back because it is now your turn. You may put your model anywhere. I would not put it there because <laughs> that is a space that you cannot move from. Uh, if you wanted to, I mean, you can go here and you could try to jump to here, which would be just two. And that would give you these three and the mound. And then you can use your next action to move off the board if you wanted to. Well, actually four because you got this one too. It's up to you, or you can just use your two actions and move off the board, or you can fight these guys. It's whatever you want to do. I'm done with this BS. Do you have... Nope, you sure don't. Okay, alright, so we're done. So move these off the board, and uh, we get to move on to the boss phase. So take all of these off. 
The fucking board's a mess. Alright. I appreciate it when Tabletop Sim does not grab the damn models. Instead, they just float off into oblivion. Alright, so now we are going to have uh, the King Knight. King Knight has 15 health. So here's how uh, this shit works. We don't need that no more. We don't need these at all. Actually, I think actually I think that's for the boss. Hang on. Is that for the boss? Maybe. Put that there. Boss has 15 health. Um, I'm going to just put this up here. We shuffle the boss deck. Now he does... So the way this is basically going to work... Um, the boss will be, of course, on the board. Uh, somewhere. I'll, I'll figure that out in a sec. Um, it's basically going to be your turn, boss turn, my turn, boss, or my turn, boss turn, your turn, boss turn. And it's just going to go back and forth like that. Mm. Place the boss turn, that card, next to player for both. Okay, so. The boss is always going to start right here. We may place our models anywhere on this spot, spot there. I didn't know we can start on the walls. Oh, no, that's ground. Yeah, that's ground. Uh, attacking the box works the same way as attacking a basic enemy, except that when a knight wounds a boss, they receive two coin tokens for each wound. So damaging him does, well, wounds. Uh, uh, does gives you money for, for attacking him. After each knight's turn, draw one boss AI card from the boss AI card deck. This boss, the boss AI card, uh, shows either an image of the boss tile in full. It shows either an image of the tile. Okay. Uh, wording. Space is highlighted in, in image uh, in the spot. Uh, spaces highlighted in red are attacked, while spaces in highlighted in white are safe. Boss will move to the space shown on the card. If a if a knight is standing in the red square, the boss is, uh, does damage, by the, gets hit by the boss. Uh, knights must roll their defense against the attack. If uh, the knight receives a wound, they must additionally drop one coin for each wound received in that space. And they are pushed one space to the left. If they are on the leftmost side of the board, they are knocked down instead of being pushed one space to the left. If a knight is standing in a white square, they're safe. Um... Once the boss completes a turn, discard the AI card into a uh, AI card deck into a pile. If you run through the deck of AI uh, AI cards, uh, flip the discarded boss AI card deck over. Do not shuffle the deck. The boss AI card deck can only be used like this th uh, three times before the far boss fight times out. After the last knight completes their turn for the round, the boss performs the special action listed on the ba boss stat card instead of pulling another boss AI card. The special action is unique to each boss. If a boss causes enemies to spawn, they will activate after all player knights have gone, but before the boss resolves his end of round ability. Final wound dealt to the boss is worth five coins. Once the boss has been defeated or the boss fight timed out, the knights add up all the total coins plus their heirloom loot cards. The knights with the most coins is the winner. There's a tie. Each knight rolls three dice. Whoever gets the most shovels wins the game. Okay. Uh, all right. So. Bosses don't activate like enemies, but instead they follow the boss and die after each knight's turn. So I guess I just get to go first. So I'm going to go ahead. I can't actually, actually, I can't even fucking do much about his ass right now. I am going to move here and end my turn. I'm going to just try to avoid his first attack and see what we can do. Because I can't, if I, I can't move to him and attack him, I only have three moves or one, two, three. Yeah, I would take up my entire turn to move there. All right. You're up, Blood Wolf. I'd like to say you go, then he goes. Oh, then I go. shit, you're right. You're right. Glad you thought about that. Uh, well, I, we both get hit. So he's actually going to end up on my tile, and we both take a... Wait, no, no, you don't. You're safe. I'm not. So I might die here. He has two attacks. 
So I have uh, three defense. So I got to defend against two. Fuck. Oh, I got it. Ooh, I was going to be pissed. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Your turn now. Three. All right. So now he's going to do a special attack because it's the end of your turn. Yep. Uh, Deanna. Move King Knight to the space of the winning hero. King Knight knocks down that player, then attacks them. How much, how much money do you have? Four. Okay, that would be me. So I get knocked down. So I have to spend an action. Okay, so he doesn't even attack. He just knocks someone down. Okay. He knocks them down, then attacks them. Oh, then attacks them. Oh. Of course he does. Do you even he... get to defend yourself since knocked down? Yeah, you still get your defenses. Oh, thank God. I'm good. All right, my turn. Okay, so I'm going to take an action to stand up, I guess. Fucking dumb. Um, and then I'm going to attack his shit. Plus one attack, plus one jump, yeah. All right. He has an armor of two. I have to be a two. I did not. I failed. Um... I'm going to Cascading for my last attack. Whoops. Get, Get that motherfucker. motherfucker. Hey. I just want this one dice. Oh, that doesn't matter, does it? Fuck. I fall down because I failed. All right. You're up. Oh, wait, no, he has to do his AI thing. Okay, so all the tiles from here are attacked, and he moves over to this opposite corner. But we don't take damage, so that's nice. Seriously, how the fuck are we supposed to hit him if we can only move three and he gets to go anywhere on the board, basically? It depends on the card. We gotta memorize his attack I'm patterns. I'm gonna stay in, in this spot. Okay. So he's gonna do his special attack where he's gonna move to us and hit, knock me down again. Which I'm already knocked down. Then he's gonna attack me. Um. Be right back. Don't give me a piece of food. So be all be. I'm good. All right. I'll go ahead and do my turn. Um. Guess I'll spend a movement and fucking action to stand back up. And then I'm going to spend four dice to attack his ass. I'm going to attack him again. God, finally one hit. How much, how much do I get? Each wound I get two. I did one damage. Yay. Um, pull that. I guess it is a little hard with two players, not going to lie. Um, I'll, I'll go ahead and do my defenses against him. While digital is waiting. And I die. I didn't get a single damn defense. Bullshit. Three dice. I'm going to say he's going to get it. I'm going to get a fiber. Now we got to wait for digital to come back. Our blood wolf. Come on. Yeah, here. I'm starting knocking things over like a damn cat. But where's my, uh, where's my tiny table? 
Oh, I can't have a... That's right, I got my plumbus. Yeet! Yeah, say like I got my tiny table. I can flip it. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah, super tiny. <laughs> Just a little reorganizing, that's all. Amiibo figures? What? Oh! Fucking bullshit. There's a 3D fucking figures this whole time. Oh, God damn it. A volley sized? Yeah. Just not as angry. This whole time we had 3D figures just sitting here. I didn't even know it. Look at that. Why is there. Why are they purple? Well, that's gold. A mess just like real life. I know, right? Are these? No, no, the Enchantress is not. What is this? Loot Knight. The fuck are you? The f oh, they just put the damn fish on his fucking Shovel Knight. Okay. Oh, Shield Knight. Yeah, Shield Knight's in the game. Okay. I don't know about that one, though. Shovel Knight boss, you know. Even need a special thing for that. Mr. Hat. Who the fuck are some of these characters? Reese, Phantom Striker. Oh, those are from the the, the DLC box, I think. Oh, this shit. This is just wigging the fuck out. Holy crap. Bye. Bye-bye. Oh. Um, let's see. What what else can we spawn in here while we wait for... Oh, we got a banana. There you go. You can have a banana. There, put it right in there. Run your inventory. Oh, oh, bye. Oh, there it is. <laughs> there. Digital now has a banana in their inventory. Um. Oh, you know what? Digital's been so cool about this shit here. You can't have... You can have a whole Steam gift card. How about how about that shit? Right there, put that that is inventory too. You have a Steam gift card. How about that and a banana? Let's see how much shit we can just put into his fucking or her uh fucking thing. Dragon man. Ooh, you know what? Needs a plumbus. Oh, don't fuck. I am back. Oh shit, you're back. What the fuck are you doing? Putting stuff into your <laughs> putting stuff into your hand. <laughs> I was bored. So, uh, so the king killed me, and you took all my loot. So there you go. How's that? But I did one whole damage on him. Your turn. Also, I found 3D models, but only of us. <laughs> See, I can't even do shit because he's always... He's over... Th he's, oh, he's a little bit further away, I know. Okay, move one space and end it. Okay, so he's going to move to you and knock you down, and then attack you. Hydrate. Hydrate. This it. is There's just a another. threat. Take one damage. Oh, God. Oh, hey, thank you for giving me a Steam gift card. Yeah, no, it's $20. Hey, I want. I'll. I will want to type that in and see if it works or not. Oh, no, that thing's been around since the start of Tabletop Simulator. <laughs> That'd be funny though. That would be. So I take fucking... one point of damage. Now it's my turn. A banana. King guy's such an asshole. Wow, he is an asshole. I use one point to get up. It's not your turn. It's my turn. You did. I uh, thought. Yeah, but at the end of your turn, I give. I become alive again. I'm gonna move. God dang it, this is where you keep fucking me because I can't hit him. Well, we'll see. 
I will move there. I don't want. I want to hit him. I want to hit him real, real hard. I want to take him real hard. I'm gonna hit him real hard with. Nope. Not gonna hit. God damn. Thanks, game. Thanks. I appreciate the four armors when I died at just a moment ago. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, so he's going to move right where he is and hit us both. So we both have to take a hit from him. Well, we roll three. Uh, so roll three dice and try to get two uh, things. I take two damage. And I drop two coins, which I just give straight to you. Because you pick them up on your turn. Yeah, I drop two coins and you get it. Yeah, they just come to me. Actually, I think the way it would work, we would drop them. My turn, I would pick up all four, but whatever. Fuck it. Um, okay. Actually, no. You now would it's pick... my turn? Yeah, it, yeah. actually, you would pick them up. Never mind. So, yeah, it's your turn. Look, you can hit them. First things first. I use the Snuckles, which gives me additional four attack. Uh, it doesn't give you an additional four. It says attack four. So it makes your attack four. Hmm, let's go read this to make sure. Because uh -huh. if I can do that, I will fuck that sound in peace. Well, because if you notice, the cloak says plus one attack. This just says attack four. Mm -hmm. so, That's what I'm saying. Attack. Move that back. And I use the chalice. So on my next level, I get oh. to add three dice. You also get to push me. Where would you like to push me? One space. You're not that strong. Hopefully you don't get hit there. Because <laughs> basically what you're doing is that you fly two spaces, hit all enemies in path, all heroes in path are pushed, may move through walls. So it's like you're going to probably move like a space and then right back to it. So that's that way you can hit him. So yeah, so you would you would do an attack four. So you would have those four dice. And this is not considered an attack action, by the way. It's not one of your actions. It's it's a free action. Uh you do one damage, you get two coins. Nice. And then you still yeah. have uh three actions to do if you want. I use this to use my power. And I use this for oh, last turn. This gets discarded, by the way. Ah. What are you doing? I meant to discard that one last turn because on because oh, I used it? its ability to add three dice. Oh. Is that what that does? Mm -hmm. Add three dice to your next row. Yeah. Fully kill HP. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Yeah. Fuck them up. And I'm using cascading, which means... I have a total of six dice to work with. Uh, what about on text space with more than one enemy model? Yeah, so you would only have that. The three, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh he takes one. Okay, so you get two coins from that, so make sure you take your, to your coins. I don't think I took it last time. Okay. Yeah, I did it. Alright. Three or better. Uh, miss, you fall on your face. So you did, you still have two actions. So you'd have to use an action to stand up, and you still have one action left. Back it. Money again. You're going to cascade again? Okay. Uh, you fall on your face. You are face down. His armor is just BS. It's just two. It's only two. We're just rolling really bad. We should be able to get more than two. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, he's going to go to the player that has the most money. That's you. Oh, actually, is it? Four, five, six, seven, eight. Which do I have? Four, five, six. Yeah, so it's you. So he's going to go to you and knock you down, which you already knocked down, and he's going to do an attack on you. So go ahead and roll your defenses. Which I think is, what, still the two? Yeah. 
Uh, you take two damage, and you uh, drop half your moonies. Okay. Yep. All right. Uh, my turn. One action here. I want to scoop all this up. And then I am going to go ahead and attack him, which is four dice for me. Oh, wait. That means I get a relic now. It does. Uh, should I use mine, though? All I do is move forward three. Or a relic carbacy. That doesn't matter. Doesn't matter at all. Hmm. Okay. First set of attacks. Whop. One, two, three, four, or three. Yay! He, I take, I do a two, and he take one damage. Uh. And we do it again. Let's go! Damn it! Alright. Now he's gonna be an asshole uh, and do whatever the hell this does. Which uh, does hit me, and he goes to here. Yeah, he says somehow this is harder for me to follow along with the nemesis. Um, it's, it's just because there's a lot of shit on the board right now. If I had a better play, play board, it would, wouldn't be so bad. I'm pretty sure we're doing it right. So I defend against his attacks. I'm good. It probably, it probably be better. Let me see what the two player variant is real quick. There's a co-op variant. Oh yeah. See what we could also do. What we could also do to, uh, there's one which maybe we'll do. If we play this again after this, uh, instead of playing one night, we played two nights. Because there is a variant to play with two nights if you're playing two player. So, anyways, your turn. You have to be along the left, yeah. Okay. All right. Now he's going to move to the player with the most coins. That's me and knock my ass down and hit me again because he's a dick. And I survive. All right. Uh, my turn. Uh, since he wanted to... Beat Broski's ass, man. Beat uh, his ass. That's what I'm trying to do. I just get getting shitty-ass rolls. You're telling me I had, like, fucking eight dice and all of them... I know. ...fucking sucks. Like, what the shit? There, three. I get two more di two more coins, and he loses the health. One... Oh, I gotta spend a I gotta spend a turn to get up. Uh, two, but it misses. All right, that's the end of my turn. So, digital, you're up. He's up first, actually. He has three more cards in his deck before we do this again. Hey, Rack, yeah, I'm doing all right. He goes brrr, and stops there. He misses everything. Okay, now King Knight. You can you, actually. Bitch. Why don't you put your dude right on him? You could be in the space. A right over here. One. Why would one, you? Why are you doing two. that? Why are you doing that? This this is where you spawn is on the left side of the board. You can spawn on him and use three turns well, to attack. Remember, I don't spawned in. I moved over here. Oh. Oh. Last time. Oh fuck. Okay, I thought you were off the board. My bad. Fuck. I move it over here. <laughs> All right. And the king gets. Let's go. Okay, let me just double check something really quick. Because it's fuck it's the king You're right nice to... now. Mm. Once the boss completes his turn, after the last night completes his turn, the boss performs special action. Instead of pulling. Okay, yeah, so he, so he does. So he's just going to come over and knock me down and attack me every single time as long as I have the most coins. That's really fucking annoying. 
I defend. I'm good. So I spend an action to stand up. We'll play a drinking game. Take a drink every time I have to say I spend an action to stand up. Hey, hey, hey. I think me and him both getting annoyed right now. Hydrate. Uh, this is just a threat. I see that, Log Wolf. What the fuck? All right, hang on. I'll take a drink in a second. You said it. He said when he has no, to say it. No, no, no. I said we might. I didn't say we were. Okay. Well, I'll use my points. Anyways. I miss. Um, so I'll attack him again. And it's sad as we rolling full fucking dice. Yeah, yeah, and the shovels are the most common ones, and we're just not getting them. Um, he's going to hit this whole fucking row and teleport to here. Oh, Bitch. I have to Mother now. I have, have, I have to defend. Which I'm good. All right, your turn. Damn it. Oh, you know what we should be fucking doing? We should be doing cascading. I should be doing cascading at least. Spin a coin and try to do multiple damp multiple hits on him or some shit. I don't know. We also got shitty stuff in the store. Like the store gave us really crappy uh draws. Oh, wait a minute. Huh, what's up? I'm reading this. It says you may move one space and choose to continue the cascading attack on a new enemy. Yeah. And so we don't have to do that. We can continue hitting the same one. Yeah. Okay. Thank God. That's what we've been doing. Yeah. No. I... <laughs> yeah, you can, but you can just because what? It, okay. So what it is in the game of Shovel Knight, it, it plays a lot like the old DuckTales game. Your main attack is to do a downwards bounce with the shovel. So what you're doing ah. is you're bouncing on his head repeatedly. But it sucks he hasn't gave him brain damage yet. Yeah, but it sucks he has two fucking defense. You can't seem to get now, past. That's the reason we can't get past one to two fucking shovels. Well, he only has one card, and he's gonna reset his deck. Well, he's gonna start over, I should say. I don't remember what the hell order it was though. Anyway, it's your turn. You can actually you have a good spot to go after him, though. Because you're right next to him. I ended my turn. I was over here. Oh. <laughs> and I, over here. So I moved over here. See, this guy was really easy when Ruby and I played because we didn't do where he did attack every single turn. We did it after we both went. So we just beat the shit was out of him. Was that that was... With so was that the right way or the wrong no, way? No, we're doing it the right way currently, but I think the way they want you to play two players is where we have two knights each. Is what I'm guessing. Um, because the way Ruby and I did, we're like, wow, the boss was ridiculously easy, but it's like he's not supposed to be that easy. But now he's like ridiculously hard. So I think there we just we just gotta we gotta play with two knights instead of one each. So your turn's over. He's gonna come over, knock me down, and attack me because I have the most. At least I'm guessing out the most. I think I do. Yeah. I'm good. Hey, at least we could get fucking armors like that. Yeah, it'd be nice if I can get shovels like that. That'd be really fucking cool, wouldn't it? I oh, I didn't act. Oh yeah, I do. I do get knocked down. I spend an action to get up. Then I attack him with the goddamn dice of destiny. He takes a damage. I get two. Um. Yay! He 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 lost five health. I know, right? Or get down, get down with sickness, Isaac. Holy shit! You know what? Fuck it! I'm taking that. I'm taking that. One, but, but, two, but three. But that one's on its side. Ah. Uh... I don't roll it. I I would not call it outside. So, in tabletop, the way you would test for that is you would put a dice on top and see if it falls off. The dice would definitely not fall off on that one, but um, we can't really test that. Fuck you. <laughs> Let's take the whole board out right now. Wow. Well, he still takes two goddamn damage. Stupid bastard. <laughs> and I have four. 
All right. Um. All right, final card. He does the L and hits none of us. It is now your turn. I'm attacking you, motherfucker! You got one attack. Because that's two movements. Using cascading. Okay. Cascading, you better fucking look. You understand me, bitch? Give me all twos. All twos. All twos. You fall down. <laughs> hey, gave me all twos. That's not on the ones that's I the wrong, You got the right twos, though, yeah. All twos. Uh, he comes over, knocks me down again. And I got to roll for... I'm good. All right, now. This is the first time we've reset the deck. We do not shuffle it. We just flip it over. Hydrate. Pull from the top. This is just a threat. Well, actually, it doesn't mean I have to attack him. So I spend a turn to get up. Fine, hydrate. I may as well just leave the cap off the bottle at this point. Oh, I should be doing a string game with some fucking ice. It's warm. All right. Jump off. Please tell me. Give me, that, give me that shovels again. Please give me those shovels again. I want him to die. Oh my god. Nope. Do it one more time. Uh, nope, he defends. Okay. Whop. Um, he, he bounces all over the place. He misses me. He misses both of us. We're good. Your turn. Hold up, one, Hello, two. motherfucker. Yeah, but you can't do nothing. That's both your move. That's all three of your actions. God damn it! Try to make space for you. <sighs> and guess what he does? He moves to me and knocks me down and attacks me. <laughs> that king really hates you. Yeah, well, he just killed me. No, not Condor. No. Yeah, but now I gotta do this shit. Um, two, three, four. Can I just highlight and have it tell me how much is in that shit? No. Why is that not a function in Tabletop Simulator? It's in some games, not all games. Oh fuck. Okay, thanks. Okay, so there's five. Drop that in there. All right, and I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty. All right, so that's actually what he drops right, uh, right there. I drop that. Okay. All right. It's my turn. I come on the board. I move one space to pick up my money. <laughs> I attack him <laughs> for four fucking dice. And we did this shit again. Uh, that one's definitely cocked. Hold up. That one's definitely cocked. Fuck you, game. All right, you're... Oh. Uh, he got bwomp bwomp, and then he uh, teleports over to here. Your turn, digital. I'm not even fucking moving. Okay. Not gonna move. Guess what he does? He comes over and knocks me down and attacks me again. Man, it almost sounds like you <laughs> you will enjoy this. Uh I take two I take one damage. And I lose two coins, is it? No, one coin. I think it's one coin. Uh, 
Oh, and you get pushed. To, I keep forgetting that you get pushed to the left as well. You drop one coin and you get pushed to the left. So I get whoop, right there. At the end of the turn, he comes over and knocks me down. <laughs> fucking attacks me. Wow. I saved that like a boss. All right, cool. My turn. I get up and I attack the boss. Uh, he does take one damage this time. So I get two here and minus one here. He's he's almost there. He's getting there. Uh, I I got her. I take home one more time. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Uh, he takes three this time. Uh, that means I get six coins. So one and one. All right, Digital, your turn. We have been on this for two hours and some odd minutes. One, two. Oh, Actually. wait, wait, hang on. Before you go, he has to ah, do his fucking shit. Yeah, he's got to do his shit. He hits you and teleports to the corner like a bitch. Get him! Okay. Uh, so you only take one damage. And you, so that means, now when you take damp, no, 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 hold up, hold up, put that back. You ain't done yet. You drop a coin, you get pushed to the left. For every wound you take, so one. One. Two, and you get Two. both those up. And you have one more action. All right. On his turn, he comes over, he knocks me down, and attacks me. He really likes you. He does. That's because every time he, I die, see, that's why it has to be, it's probably, it's probably two balls per person. Because otherwise this wouldn't happen. Uh, I defend, I'm good. I can defend. We like playing this on like hard difficulty. Right. All right. Uh, my turn. I get up. Uh, he's gonna take another damage. <laughs> okay. Um, he's gonna take another damage. He only has two <laughs> health left. Oops. Oh, did they even see it? Oops, I took two. All right. Um, he's going to go bwomp and land there. He hits neither of us. He's That's it. Your turn. Finally. You could kill him. Hello, this motherfucker. Hello, motherfucker. Die, you piece of shit. I should be a real shit right now, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Mm, that's a miss. When <laughs> you get done growling at the screen. I get back up. Uh, No, you don't have to get back up. You move. I thought cascading if you fell. It, oh, you get you're cas down. I didn't know you were cascading. I didn't hear you say that. Okay. Yeah, that's why I paid the coin well, fee. I did not see that. Okay. I I probably should be cascading. Uh I keep forgetting that cascading's a thing. Um Yeah, you got one more move. Oh no, 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 you don't. That's it. That's your you're done. Because getting up is is done though. So he's gonna move over here and knock me down. I'm gonna take a fucking attack. I am going to defend it. I'm good. Uh I stand up, I attack him. I attack again. Oh my god. He, has, he takes one damage. He has one fucking health left. Digital, you can kill him. Uh, he hits both of us this time. And uh, he stops there. I defend perfectly. I take one damage and drop a coin, and I get knocked down because I'm against the wall. Um, okay, so you're fine, so your turn. Whee! Hello, you piece of shit, now die. So that's two movement, uh, so you get one attack. 
Uh, he Funny is, me. He is not dead because you need three shovels. Jesus Christ. Him and his fucking arm. So guess what he does? <laughs> he teleports to me and knocks me down even though I'm knocked down. And he attacks me again. He really hates you. He hates me. I defend. I'm good. Um, My turn. I get up. I collect my dueler. I think he's thesis is against shapeshifters. Oh, probably. Hey, you killed him! Oh my god, he's fucking dead. Holy shit. Yeah, yay! But, uh... <laughs> eat shit. Oh my god, eat shit. Game over. Game's over! <laughs> Alright, so that's... That's... Shovel Knight. Now... Okay. So, all that being said, digital, I kind of want to play another game of this. <laughs> but, but hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. But we, could, we could characters tell character, each. Yes, we get two characters each. And furthermore, let's, we get to pick characters. How about that? Because you basically get the one. gist of the game. Yeah. Life's boss is bullshit asshole who keeps knocking. I think you it's I think it's because we only had uh two characters. Look at all the see all the shit I had to move over to get everything to fit on this tiny ass board. Like this is why didn't why is the table so small? So here's how this is gonna work, digital. Um of all these characters here, and even the all the bosses and all that can, are playable characters. You can play as anyone you want. In fact, Shovel Knight himself is actually can be said as a boss if you flip over his card. Wait, what? Yep, the whole time you were playing as a boss. Okay. So, go ahead, and I want you to pick a character this time. What the heck is... Those are, are, those are just amiibos. Those are the 3D models of Shovel Knight. That's where I found them. And that's the Entrantress. You don't... Uh, okay. Special Bouncy Bomb. Oh, she has a passive, too. Oh, did we have a passive? I didn't see it fucking... No, we did not. We did not, huh? Okay. And she cannot be a boss. Uh, no, she can be. There's... It's... She's right here. That's probably an alternate version of her or something. Let me see. Oh yeah, this is the boss variant here. So. Wow, she looks so more badass. Yep. Well, I'll let you set the game up because I'm gonna grab some more food. Are you, you gonna play as? Are you gonna play as her? Yes. Okay. So yeah, you can keep it on the start. Um, as for me. It'll be more interesting now? Absolutely. What do you think, guys? Like, who should we play as? We got King Knight, Spectre Knight, Plague Knight, Mole Knight, Polar Knight, Treasure Knight, Black Knight, Propeller Knight, Tinker Knight, Baz, Mr. Hat, Grease, Phantom Striker. Pretty sure these can be played as, yeah? yeah. Uh, can they? Yeah, they can. Okay. What do you guys think in chat? What do you think? Oh, we also have Shield Knight, Fish Head, apparently. I don't know. What the fuck is Fish Head? Oh, he's just Shovel Knight. Not Fish Head. Plague? I figured you'd pick Plague. Because Plague Doctor, you like Plague Doctors. Um, The Plague Knight DLC is actually kind of cool for uh, Shovel Knight. Because the thing is, uh, with the Shovel Knight game, I don't remember if you have to pay for the DLC or if it's free. But uh, you do get to play as Plague Knight, which is one of the bosses. Which was for Junk? Uh, probably the Tinker Knight, because he's super tiny, just like Junk Knight. Okay, I'm going to just toss... I'm going to get all this shit that we don't need off the fucking board. Um... One of the problems, though, with just leaving, I don't know what boss will play against me. Um, so what about bosses, though? What do you guys, who do you think we should go against out of this roster? 
Is there anyone in particular you guys are feeling? Like Spectre Knight. Not King Knight. We won't do King Knight. Um, well, Enchantress. We won't, uh, we won't do Plague Knight because... Yeah. Oh, that's his boss cards. Yeah, we don't need that shit. So we can actually delete that. Um, well, if Isaac is paying attention... I don't know if I just paying attention. We got Mole Knight. You get Fish Guy. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and delete those as choices. Isaac, who should we play against? Should we play against... Uh, oh, we can't do Enchantress because Enchantress is taken. So we've got... Oh, we can't do Mona. Uh, no Amiibos. So we have Spectre as our boss. Should we play against Spectre Knight, Treasure Knight, Polar Knight? Actually, I know I know which one Isaac wants. He probably wants Polar Knight because Polar Knight's the big beefy guy, Nordic barbarian guy. Something green. Uh, if we're going green, there's Propeller Knight. Okay, sure. So we have the green. A green would be Propeller Knight or Polar Knight. Which one, Isaac? Ruby says polar, but Ruby already had a choice taken. No choice for you. Polar? Yeah, I figured as much. Polar's actually, uh, in the game, he's massive. He's really big. He's a, he's actually an interesting character. Okay, so just to make Rue, I'm going to just... Del oh, shit. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. Don't delete the polar knight because I actually need his box. Okay. There, there. So we can get some damn room. Delete. Shuffle that. I'm going to put all this up here to the side because we don't need it yet. Uh, in fact, let's, let's just go ahead and put all this on top of here. I'll just put it all up there. Um, These. We'll actually put these right there. Okay. Paul and I appreciate sure he has 15 health, right? Yeah, he has 15 health. I think all the bosses have 15. Boss. Extra thick. All right. Now, these, I'm just going to pull them. Pull. Extra thick. Yeah. So we're going to get, we're going to go up against the Polar Knight. Digital. Okay. Mm. Um, I still I think these are for custom boards, maybe. I'm gonna put them way up here so we don't have to worry about their asses. Uh now I'll be the plague knight. I'm gonna put this like over here or some shit. Oh. Oh. Balls. We have to pick two characters. <laughs> so you want the Enchantress. So go ahead and take the Enchantress. Delete, delete, delete. Um, I'm pretty sure we can delete those. Okay, so we're gonna do Polar Knight is gonna be our boss. So digital, pick another character. That is the uh, was it Phantom Striker? Oh wait, was that one yours? No. Ah. Okay, so you chose Phantom Striker. That's what you want. Mm -hmm. Uh chat, go ahead and pick another character for me. We won't do Enchantress because Enchantress is being played. Uh, oh, I have Plague Knight. Let me, let me grab Plague Knight shit. Wait, now, if you were going to use it last one, I would give it over to you and just pick it up, pick someone else. No, 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 that's fine. <laughs> I I wasn't. Like, seriously, I wasn't. Ah. So, what do you think, chat? Um, what we got? We got Spectre Knight, King Knight, 
That black and red one, Ruby said. Black and red one? Uh, so, Spectre Knight or Black Knight? I'm guessing Black Knight, right? King? Uh, Spectre? No? God damn it, Shonji. Shit together. You won the game. Wow. Can we do, is there a slash rolling in the chat? Can we do slash roll? No, we cannot. Ah, uh, Black Knight. Right, I'm just going to go with Black Knight so we can get going. Black Knight. Black Knight. Um, actually, I don't need his deck. Just his cards. And, okay, so you got your two characters, right? You're good to go. And you have your standees. Mm -hmm. I should have a rolling function in the chat. That's what I should have. Digital, I'll let you be first player this time around. You can choose which one of your characters will go first. What we'll do is we will... Um, you do a character, I do a character, you do a character, I do a character. So I play one, then the other one, then you go, then I go again. Uh-huh. Okay, so I don't need the boss ones for that. Wait, where's... um? Okay, Plague Knight's there. Hang on a second. I, I, I have to set those up. Uh, that's what I was doing. Uh, No, let me... Before you do that... Actually, if you want to, if you want to do something while I'm doing this, uh, moving this shit, try to find the polar knight shit. Pull out all the grass ones and all the polar knight ones, which it should be. His is like an ice level. So this won't be it because it's. No, uh... But that well, we need that anyways because that's the grass area. So we need that. Oh yeah, so basically get all the grass into one. Yeah. Wait, where did his standing go? Uh, this is uh, snow and lava. Okay, so we just need the snow. So, if, yeah, snow puts the snow up, yeah. But don't we flip it, though? Uh, yeah, but for right now, just so we can see, just do it like that, because it's easy to flip it. That is the castle. Okay, let me read this. Two player variant. With two player, we recommend both players play against each other as a team of two. Yeah, thanks. Player two is a team. Uh, each team starts with six coins, all claimed by both knights, put into one point. Okay. That's even a single player mode, huh? Interesting. Okay. Uh, did you find them all? Yep. Okay, and these blank ones, I mean, we don't... I'll say let's delete those because we don't, we don't fucking need them. I think these are for custom ones or something. I don't know. Uh, okay, so these are all the snow ones, right? And these are all the grass ones? There's only four of them? Oh yeah, because mm -hmm. you got because you have the start ones. Delete, delete. All right. Um. So what we'll do? We will shuffle. Hydrate. This is just a threat. Hydrate. All right. Mm. All right. Um. Put those like this.
You had to touch it. You had to touch it. Yeah, I done had to mess it up on my screen anyways. Was working fine. Alright, so there's our board. Holy shit, what the fuck are we looking at for our first setup? Damn, does anybody want some spikes? Now remember, you can put your character wherever you want. You don't. Have, they don't. They can all be on the same spot if you want. Put them on the same spot. It's up to you. <laughs> we have one skull. Oh. Hell yeah, throw it back. Womp. Ah, uh, one lone samurai. Ah, uh, okay, that can be deleted. There, we got so much more space. That looks so much better. Relive the spike hell levels. Ah, seriously. All right, so digital, the way you're going to set this up, you're going to have your knights basically next to each other. You're going to start the game with six coins, so your coins are going to be in a pile together. But the knights have their own loot. You're going but to anybody can buy, both of them can use the coins. Yes. And if either one of them dies, you lose half of that pile. <sighs> Man, these guys only have four health. Holy shit, they're weak. My god. What the fuck type of... Damn. They're weak compared to the other guys. What the hell? No, they're not the heroes, but they have more unique abilities, though. And it's true. Like, Pike Guy can throw stuff. Special move, boom, spend two coins, roll a single attack that hits all models in a single space. Black Knight, Dark Wave, spend two coins, roll a range attack against a single model. Oh, he has four attack? Holy shit. Holy shit. Mine has four attack, two defense. Wow. Yeah, so is mine. Um... And here's a card for you as well. Here, we'll put the book up here. So it's out of the way. Okay. That looks a lot cleaner. Oh, yeah. But just remember, too, so both knights will only, can only hold three loot cards at a time. Just like normal. The only thing that's really different is that the, the uh, card pool is merged. Or the coin pool is merged together. Otherwise, the knights kind of act independently of each other. Okay. Okay. Yeah, much nicer. I like my boards being clean. I got a little anal about it. Like I like I like a nice, just clean setup. <laughs> Well, you said it's my turn? Uh, yes. Yeah. So pick which knight you want to be the first player. So give him the first player token. Okay. So that knight's going to go first. So Mona is going to go first. Oh, actually, I got... Where do I want to put my guys, though? Uh, He's going to fuck this guy up. Okay. She's going to fuck this motherfucker up. I would laugh if you fucking fail your roll. They attack files from okay. Need three shovels. And they're dead. Got four. Yeah, they're <laughs> dead. 
There's... I overkilled them. Yep. Doesn't matter, you still get the same amount. Okay. That's, uh, you got one more action. Three more monies. All right. Um, I'm gonna do Black Knight first. So I I gotta try to remember. In fact, let me let me do this. Let me move this back. So I remember Black Knight first, then Plague Knight. Um. Black Knight, he is going to move forward one, and he's going to do a jump action to here. So there's a jump of two. I need two shovels, or two jumps. I got it. So I jump to here. I get th uh, three money. Uh, I'm going to spend, let me see what we got here. That's saying, can they trade off stuff with some uh, partner? I, no, they cannot. Um, I'm going to grab the trench blade for him. And spend Ooh, the bitch. one. And spend the one. That's a nice one. Uh, and my turn. Your turn. That's his. Don't move the bar. Where the fart? If we can actually lock that one down, that one can stay. I got it. Okay. Oh, okay. Guess you uh, took right. the other one that was gonna get. Yep, sure did. Don't kick your get, ass fuck, now. Get fucked on. Uh, you had the person's turn now. All right, plague night. Ah. Uh... I'm gonna go. Should I try for it? <sighs> no, I'll play it safe. I'll move there and my turn. Actually, <laughs> do 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 do. Absolutely fucking can. <laughs> I'm gonna move here. I'm gonna do a shove action on Mona to try to shove her into the spikes. <laughs> Get fucked on. <laughs> So basically, I gotta roll three attack versus your what one defense? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Are we attacking each other? I'm not attacking you. I'm shoving you. We can't attack each other, but I can absolutely push you into a pit of spikes, which I do successfully. Now you're gonna have to do your defense. To, uh, actually, shoot. You know what? Let me just double check, make sure I'm doing this correctly before we, I, I, you know, end up murdering your character. Jump action, take actions. I mean, it's a little bit because.
Okay, so you get to defend. So I success succeeded with one. So you take your die and you have to roll a one or better on your one die. You failed. So she goes flying into the pit and dies. You, lose, you drop half your shit into the pit. <laughs> I am done after this game. Gloves are gloves are off digital. <laughs> oh, I promise I don't want to get your money because I'll probably die. It was actually called Shovel Knight because you can shove. Well, <laughs> it's called Shovel Knight because they're using shovels. But it, it is a competitive game, yes. Um, he's done. Um, both your did both your characters go? Mm hmm. Okay. So there's no enemies, so we move down one. Hang on. <laughs> stay on top, please. Stay, stay on fucking top. Okay. Um. Okay, so we get two enemies. Ooh, gross. We get two of these assholes. Fucking hell. We got those assholes. Then we drop one here. This is a head cannon now for the game. Well, I mean, they they do it. A sh they call it a shove action because of that. Yeah, it, it it's all shovel puns. I mean, that's the game in general. I mean, Shovel Knight's always been about the shovel puns. All right, yeah, uh, you you go first, digital with your Mona. I feel like Striker at the at Mortal on the at the beginning of what Mortal Kombat Armageddon where he just punches Katana like right off the gate. Did you fail your jump action? I'm gonna guess that's a yes. Um All right. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna spend. I'm gonna spend two coins. I'm gonna buy this powder. If I can get the cards to work, that'd be really cool. Okay. Um, that's what, one action. I am going to move here. I'll take that. I will take... Uh, I've, I didn't have an Arcana card. What's that? What do these do? Discard to reroll all dice after a single roll. Any models you enter a space with this turn are hit for one damage. It's not really going to be helpful. I'm gonna, I kind of want the rerolls, actually. Okay. Um, so that's what, two actions. I am going to go ahead and attack. For four, and I have to be a one. Oh, I couldn't. Yeah, I can't do cascading on this character, can I? 
I got one, but five, six jumps for some damn reason, so I failed. And I guess that's the end of his turn. Your turn, digital. Oh, I forgot to put that up there. Ooh. That's the one you had last time. Okay. If you are talking, we cannot hear you. I am not. Okay. Where's the jumps when you actually need them? Seriously, I mean, this is scary. Like, there's a lot of shit down here you can jump through, but I mm, jumping is scary right now. I'm a little scared to try to get Plague Knight over there without dying. All right, you're in there with those two. So one, two. Got one action. What does your guys do? Freely move Phantom Striker to an unoccupied, unoccupied space three spaces away. That's actually really good. Holy shit. Roll a cascading attack if you hit the enemy. You may continue the attack on enemy in adjacent or same space. Oh, cause she, but she throws it though. Four damage. So they have one, two, three, four. So they have one health left. Okay. Ah. Uh. It's my turn. Uh, digital, I'm going to be nice to you. I'm going to give you a hint. I'm going to give you a little tip here. Why don't you come here and do it to this guy? Oh, Kay. I thought they were all in one square. No, no, he's here. Which means you go. would get another attack and you don't get blown into the pit of the spikes and die. Uh, I wish that fails. Okay. But you don't get blown into a spit pit and die. Yeah. Okay. I'll be right back again. Okay. I'm going to move. Uh, what's his jump? Oh, he gets three at least. So that's better. And I need two. Which I barely fucking clear that. Um, can I just put this in my hand? No? No, you're not going to let me do that? Thanks, Gabe. Thanks, Gabe. Holy shit. Are you, is it not going to let me put it in my hand for some reason? Thanks, Gabe. Can I buy plus one range would actually be really good for him because he he already can attack from one range away. So we'll spend one. That's uh, over here. One, and I'll take that from there. Oh, plus two HP. And that's, I think, all I can do. I have to wait for Digital. Two. It's fine, guys. You can watch me organize my coins. Okay, let's just go ahead and clear the clutter by tossing those. Grabbing a fiver right there. Okay, so it's Digital's turn. Light to target space and attack. Best best stream. Oh yeah, best stream.
Looks like the uh, Polar Knight still has walls. I don't think he has anything special. What's his ability? Clear all ice tiles and spike pit tiles off the board. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So I might have removed the spike pits from the game by completely deleting them. And we need them. Place an ice tile on Polar Knight's new space. Fuck. I'm going to have to think of other components now. Damn it. I didn't think about that. Yeah, organization simulator. Like, like, can I can I just move these a little real quick? Yeah, no. Pop. 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 Oh my god. Digital. Jordan. So how are you guys going tonight? I'm going to drink some more. Oh, Jesus. I need some, like, munchy snacks or something. I don't have any snacks to munch on. Ginger. No, Isaac. No, why is it? You're inebriated? What, Ruby, did you have like a beer? A sing one single beer? You're now inebriated? Oh, you know what? I'm a, I know what we do. Because I'm bored, we do the stacking of the dice. Uh, <laughs> You're always a bitch. I mean, what? 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 I stack the dice, I would game. Just munch on white cheddar popcorn. God, I wish I had white cheddar popcorn. It is your turn. Uh, uh, shit. Wait, wait, hold up. Oh, wait. One, two. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm sorry, digital. I didn't move the boards. Hang on. I thought you had to go. I could have done that this whole time. Oh, I can't even put her on the board. Uh, No, actually, you can. You would just move forward. So you would actually move forward one space. So you put her either here or here. Oh, uh, probably would help if I did the enemy's fucking attack, wouldn't it? That would be smart. Hang on. I... I... I fucked up. Hold up. Hold up. Okay, so uh, take her off real quick. I completely forgot. I I completely screwed up. I'm gonna blame Netherwolf because I'm drinking, and he's the moderator. So okay, so this guy moves one. Okay, so he pushes us back one, but he moves one into our space and attacks. He's gonna attack the uh probably Meek. I think I have the most. These two guys are going to move into the way. Um. So he's going. I get the Hydrate. choose. This is just a after. threat. Thanks, Digital. You're welcome, bud. I'm always helping my friends oh, out, you know? Oh, God. Get them a little bit tipsy. Bleh. Bleh. <laughs> um, I'm going to put on the Black Knight, because he has two dice. Um, uh, And their attack is a two? All right. Uh, pff, well, a four, I think, clears it, so I'm good. All right, now, now you can play. So you could only put her on this spot there. Name it. I gotta put that back. And get me oh, back. I see. Yeah. Um, I gotta become I'm tr gotta becoming. I'm trying to Ruby. I I mean, I'm this thing is. I've been only drinking this. It's thirty percent. It's the best I got. Let's see if I even make it. Nope, like normal. Uh, Shovel Knight's girlfriend does not do well with jumping. So, Rack, I live in the state of California. Best we can get out here is like 35%. I'm sorry. 
I usually have to mix it. I, I bet if I made a mixed drink, it would be a lot stronger. One shot of that would get me drunk. Oh, no, I need, like, a bottle, dude. Gin is for... Is it? Not the gin I have. Oh, shit, I got... I got tequila. <laughs> it's 40. Oh, it smells... Oh, I don't know if I can drink straight tequila, though. I'm not that crazy. Absence is 65? Really? Fuck, okay. All right. So she, Mona went. Uh, I get to go to Black Knight first. Black Knight is going to. <sighs> Black Knight is going to spend three coins. By the cloak. Oh, that's a good one for Mona. Well, the Enchantress, I should say. What's that? Is she has to be fucking jump. Yep. I, I mean, we got we got really shitty tiles from the get go. Um. Who the fuck? That's supposed to be there. Then I'm going to, um, that was one action. Not many people like that. I mean, it's, it's good, but I can only handle so much, and then I'm like, eh. I get tired of I it. I never really had the blacklist. Um, I've always liked it, even as a kid, but typically adults like it, because our taste buds change after 18 again. Um, and oftentimes it's after you turn 18 is when people start enjoying the taste of black licorice. All right, all right, all right. Off. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> all right. Uh, Black Knight's gonna move here. Oh, I didn't even do the damn enemies. Oh my god, see? What happens when I start drinking? Um, <laughs> that needs to be there. That needs to be there. <laughs> do we really have to have these assholes? What's with the fan guys? Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, look at this crap. This is bullshit. Whatever. Fuck the oh, wait, is that max four? We have more than four. Where? Where do we have more than four? Four fan guys and No no four. four on a tile. Four on a tile. Oh, so you can have eight of the small enemies on a tile then? Yes. No no no. Jeez. No, eight of each one of these can be on the board at a time. Only four per square. So, meaning only four fans can be on board. Right. So, no so, more can spawn. Right, exactly. Otherwise, it gets kind of stupid. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and attack them. For how much is it for? Okay. Uh, and I need what? How many? I need at least two shovels to do damage. I want two shovels on all four dice. Fuck you, game. One of them takes one goddamn damage. And, oops. I think that's it. I'll put it on this guy here. These two are for this dude. Or this one right here. All right, your turn. Your second character. Uh, oh. Phantom's gonna fuck this guy up. Now also the uh well actually no you're fine. If you kill him you're fine. He is not dead. 
get the health counter in there too. Fuck it. He is fine. You you need to kill him digital, otherwise you're gonna get pushed into the spikes. He's dead. Thank God. I get four fucking money. Yeah, money. Hey, oh money. Oh money, money. Money, money, money. Money, money, money. Have money, 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 funny, money. That's all I can do now. Okay, my turn. Um, I am going to play for this guy my favorite song. It's called La Bamba. Oh, bottles in a single space. Ooh, I want to do that. I'm going to blow these bitches up. Hit, I'm going to hit these two fuckers right here. For three dice. And I got to get, oh, at least one. All right, two shovels, two shovels. Come on, two shovels, two shovels. Yeah, I didn't get it. I failed. What the fuck? This is gay. Fine. Fine. I'll throw I'll just throw a normal bomb at the one that's wounded. He flexed at hundred percent. Seriously. Well he took another damage at least. Um and I'll hit him again with another bomb. Boom. All right, or I'll do fuck all. What is with these dice and not giving us shovels? You know what I feel right now? You know what I feel? Um, excuse me? I was turning my dice over. Well, all right. Uh, so that turns over. And we turn. So this character gets blown back. Uh, one of these guys is going to move up here and attack uh, probably the Black Knight. This guy's going to move up here. This guy's going to move up here. Um, he's going to attack the Black Knight for how much? Two? Black Knight has two defense. You got this, man. I believe in you, homeboy. Oh, that's I right. Believe. I forgot. I have two HP because of that thing. Um... I failed. I take two damage. <laughs> um, that's it. So that gets tossed back in the bag. Uh, these are gonna get pushed off. Wonder if my cat is ever gonna be doing anything, or she just gonna get keep getting knocked off over and over and over. Well, the good news is where the board's at. Come on, god damn it, get in there. Seriously, <laughs> seriously, tabletop sim. Why we don't pay very much for you? Okay, this guy was in here. Oh, these should be flipped over. Fuck. Uh, and you've been pulling these relic cards every time she dies, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, this should be here. This should be there. So we need one here, one here. Uh, we got a rat and a wizard. Finally, something different. And then a bony guy. And a basic bitch knight. Okay. There. All right. It is Mona's turn. There's a really nice spot right there she can go on to. So she can make her jump action and hopefully not fall into the damn pit again. You know, for the being the evil mastermind of the game, she really does uh, enjoy jumping into pits. That's what you say. God. Consumes in and out. I would love it. Look at this. Look at this. Four. 
four. She rocked that shit. Okay, so you get this too. All right, still her turn. That was on one action. She's too busy reading her book. Oh wait, that's it. That's not the enchantress. She's oh, that's Mona. Mona's different. Okay, never mind. Uh, that's one. Oh god, I'm so hungry. Okay, you're gonna attack this one or the samurai. Press tab on the one you're attacking. The liquid samurai. Thought it was spikes. Oh. No, no, there's no spikes there. There's just enemies. Okay, that that one. Well, roll again. Go ahead and roll again since you thought you thought I was wrong. So you use a, you probably use the wrong dice. So do the three attacks. Uh, that thing is beyond dead because it only had one. It had a health on it already. So. Dude, Ruby. In and out would sound so good right now. Holy shit. I would love a burger. Holy crap. Damn. Uh, so that was what? One. Actually, you know what, Digital? Because she's ranged, isn't she? You should probably stand here. And now this is my advice. This is my advice. I would stand here and attack at range because she she's a range character, so you can attack again this turn right now if you want to, and she won't get blown into spikes or nothing. Uh, so what does everyone get from In and Out? I always get the double double combo with grilled onions. Uh, I usually get soda, and then I usually get cheeseburger on the side with grilled onions. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad that Mona's just hopping in spot in her place right now. That's not helpful. God damn. Well, she fell in the pit like three times. I mean, it's about time she figured out how to fucking jump. Fuck this bitch. She is fucking stupid. This is basically Mona right now. She's like, uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Then goes over spikes. Ah! <laughs> uh Playing extra cheese, no salt on the burger patties, Dr. Peppers. Holy shit, do you even have a burger? <laughs> I'm funny. Um, okay, so Mona went. Okay, it's my turn. My turn. Um, Black Knight. Uh, Black Knight. Uh, Black Knight, um, use balls busting attack to uh, ball boss somebody. Ah, uh, wish. I wish. Uh, Black Knight is going to move here. Black Knight's going to attack for. Four against Dipshiticus here. Wait, no, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm not going to fucking do that. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to move here to... I'll move here for three. I'm not going to attack. I forgot. He pushes back. If I fail, I'm going to get pushed off the board. I don't want that. So I'll take the three coins. Damn, Condor Gay. What the fuck, bro? That's not even a volley in the chat. What the fuck? Anyways, um. See, it's hard to tell because in Discord, you're your other character on my side. So, well, I don't have a volley icons and shit. On wow, what the fuck? The man? form I take for the month is always all whatever is on Telegram. That's because most of my communication is Telegram. I keep the Synthogen on Discord because that's what most of the Protogen people see me as. 
Uh, Digital, it is your turn to do the other night. You guys should be making pyramids like this. Watch, watch me. I'm gonna do this. Let me make a pyramid. Oh. That detection in this one really sucks. Bruh. Oh, I fucked it up. I fucked up the Hang on, let me try again. God damn it. Bruh. Hello, nice to meet you. Bruh. Oh, apparently I have five combo. Uh, uh, pyramid. Oh, I guess that have to be bigger than that. But you get the idea. It's like one and three, then you try to make it before someone messes you up. Huh? What's going on? What are we doing? What are you doing? You're, you're here? Okay, what are you doing? Nothing? Yeah, my lady just moved okay. on a palm's way. He said I'll get blown back. Yeah, um, these guys can blow me. I don't give a shit. Um... <sighs> I can't even knock back, can I? You know what? Let's... I really want that cloak. I have one. Let's spend two coins. I'm gonna grab this cloak just in case I suck ass and fall in a pit. Yeah, what? Tondo, I think you need another shot. Hydrate. Oh, this is Tondo. just a threat. Oh, right there. <laughs> Did they? Hydrate. God damn it. Okay. Um, so it turns over. Huh. <laughs> oh. Um, hey, uh, so Mona gets... Mona gets blown into the pit. Was it this guy? I thought it was on the space they were on. No, if you read their card, it says the row. I'm not gonna lie, I am really hating them. <laughs> yeah, they're real assholes. I am too, and they're the rare enemies that we are pulling nothing but those jackasses. Yeah, so I say bullshit them being rare, my fucking ass. Uh, Plague Knight's gonna take a whole lot of beating, though. Oh god, he only has one die for defense. You know what, I... Fuck. I'm I am gonna use this. Fuck it. Okay, what's uh Bonna Bone King in any space and Bone Cling then attacks a model of your choice? Where are you putting the Bone Cling? You have to copy and, and paste it. I can't copy. You have that locked out for me. Okay, where do you want it? Right here. Who is it attacking? You. Wow <laughs> what an asshole. <laughs> Oh my god. Alright, fine. That's what you get for knocking me off of the map the first time, dick. Oh, well. Fucking you don't be in my way. Alright, fine. So the Bone Clang attacks me for one. I roll. And I take one damage. And then, uh, if Samurai roll hits me. For two damage. And then the fan fuck hits me for two. And I die. Um. I have to turn this in. Uh, so I'm gonna drop Condor two. is so wasted right now. You don't even know what fucking wasted is. I am not wasted. Oh. You, you wanna talk about wasted? You should go see Tibbs. He gets wasted. Zap. I, I have never been wasted. Buzzed, yes. Wasted, absolutely not. What does Wasted Condor look like? No one knows, because no one's seen Wasted Condor. In fact, I haven't seen Wasted Condor. Hey, home. Yeah. This uh, is a biggest mystery since... Well, Scooby-Doo. Um, yeah, no, Condor is fine. Condor is great. <laughs> so how's everybody doing? How are you doing, Ruby? Oh, I like that. I'll keep... I will keep that. Alrighty then. So those do their attacks. These are going to move down and down. Uh, oh, those, those can't move, actually. 
Ah, uh, damn, actually, uh, how you functional alcohol uh, alcoholic or liver of steel? Well, I mean, I'm six foot seven, three eighty pounds, and I'm Irish. So, plus, I also don't drink to get blackout drunk or nothing like that. I don't. I don't go that far, That's like kidding. ever. Why do you enjoy this, Wooby? What the hell? Having a good time. So Having these two are going to attack uh, this dude right here. They're going to attack Phantom Striker. So this is probably from what, though? The wizard, let's say the wizard. So two defense, so you're probably you're good. Then do it from the uh, helicopter rat, which is just one, yeah. And you're good. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna push you into spikes again. <laughs> Did the workout, but I haven't gotten to the art yet. Hmm. Yeah, I did my workout yesterday. I I'm still hurting from it. Wait, how many fuckers are on the fan? Uh yo yo. Not until you get in there. Hey, it's not the helicopter bullshit people ask me. Yeah, because you just can't seem to have enough of those assholes. Holy crap, look at all the enemies. Jesus, we, we've got a bad pull. All right, well, Denzel, your turn. No turn, play game. I'll plug him. Yay. Right, plug him. Oh, yeah. Oh. Actually, there's no spikes up here. One, two. Juicy, but why? Ruby's Ruby's fucking word for tonight is juicy. Juicy, juicy, juicy. Lucy. Oh God, juicy Lucy. <laughs> wow. You never have a juicy Lucy before. Those fucking hamburgers are good. No. Put some cheese inside of them. No. I no. They're. Mm. <laughs> Get your mind out of the gutters. Nope. 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 Not happening. Nope. All right. All done. Mm, nope. I'm doing range attack now. I'm okay. attacking the helicopter. Bullshit piece of shit, motherfucker. Okay. Oh, now you get your jumping shit, you stupid bitch. All right. But you so couldn't a... do that at the beginning when you needed to jump. So that's a that's a failure. Um, I'm gonna just go ahead and attack. I want to attack. I want to attack the uh, the wizard. Wizard has three health. All right, so wizard has one health. I'm going to attack it again. Misses every single shot. Hell, <sighs> you couldn't get that on the boss from last game. Oh, right. Well, the wizard dies, and actually the right <laughs> the mouse dies too because of my powder. So I actually kill both of them in one shot. So that's um, how much is that? That's three, four coins. Okay, one more action. I'm gonna move, um, move right here. Your turn, digital. Phantom Knights, uh, Phantom Strikers turn. Phantom Striker.
Damn, what the hell? What'd you, what'd you get? Just three? Mm-hmm. I'm thinking the enemies aren't going after me. Okay. So is that everything? Was that all three moves? Yes. No, that was only two. Because you were here. One, two. You have one more action. Picking up's not an action. Ah. I ain't there anyways. You end Actually, it? Actually, no. I ain't over here. Okay. All right. Uh... Hydrate. This is just a threat. Thanks, Ruby. Um. Uh... I'm going to shove Mona. <laughs> I have three. Do your defense for Mona. Hmm? I'm shoving Mona. Uh, where are you even? Right now, I'm with Mona right here. So roll one die, you have, to, you have to save on a three. All right, I am shoving Mona right here. There you go, you're welcome. I pushed you forward a little bit. Look, you even get this, isn't that cool? You get whatever the fuck that is. Yay! Um... All right, uh, so that's the end of that turn. So everybody gets pushed back. I guess I didn't really think about it. So push, push, push. Um, now we start with the Samurais. Oh, wait, that's I moved the Samurai. Samurai is going to move to the closest enemy and attack Mona. So go ahead and do your defense for Mona. Against what's his attack? Three? Or two. Two against Mona's die. Hmm? Mona's being attacked by Saburoi. Uh, take one damage? Uh, Phantom Striker is being attacked by Saburoi. Now that you have all the money, you get to be attacked for a change. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. Okay. All right. Um, next, these guys get to go. So he's going to move here. Go ahead and roll for Mona. Shit. Uh, you actually saved it, I think. Well, you only get one die, right? Yeah. You still got it. Um, let's see. Next nearest, because he's there. Next nearest would be this one. So he's going to move into here, attack the Phantom Striker. So Hover Bitch is attacking the Striker. Digital. Hmm? Phantom, <laughs> Phantom, uh, Phantom's getting attacked. Mm, yeah. Phantom has three defense. <laughs> Did you remember? You have also have that. Oh shit! I forgot about yeah. that. Yeah. Three defense against their uh, two attack. Uh, you're good. Uh, that square's full. This guy's gonna move one. This, he's not going to move there. Those, neither one of these guys are going to move. He's going to move one, and that's it. 
Uh, everything moves down. Jesus. We have one skull. What do we get? Two samurai. God damn, how many are on the board? Oh, God. One. Actually, it should be this way. No, because see where this one's at? Yeah. That and means see it... where this one's going to be. Oh, you're, yeah. right. you're right. You're right. You're right. All right, your turn. Mona's turn, I should say. Mona's gonna attack that piece of shit flying guy. Okay, attack the piece of shit flying guy. Uh, for two. So I think he takes one damage. Yeah, it takes one damage. Uh, two damage. Okay, next. He has, so he has, uh, what? How much health does he have? Three? Four? He has two more health. He is dead, so you killed him. That's a look, look goblin over here with all my money. Also appreciate that we've had one shopkeep this entire game. All right, my turn. Um, actually, no, you get one more move. You get one more thing because you only attacked twice. You have one more action. Ah. You can attack the samurai if you want, or you can move. Or jump. I don't know. Attack the samurai. It has a defense of zero. Ah, uh, he uh, takes three damage and dies. Yay. He's a dead guy now. He is indeed. Um, so Black Knight. Black Knight's going to attack the Bone Clang for three. Or wait, no, four. Sorry, four. Bone Clang has zero shields and two health, so I need two shovels. Damn it, come on. One, oops, one damage. Second move. Uh, absolutely eviscerated him, so he's dead. I get two coins. He's gone. One damage gets pushed over onto Hover Bitch. And, um. Uh, God, there's so many enemies. Um, I'm going to move him over here and end his turn. Your turn, digital. You do know you're going to get blown off too, right? Ah, you're right. You are correct. I'm going to have to go over here. No, right. no, 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 no. You are done, done it, man. Oh, well, then and you it... can take off the time I helped you and you can, you can take a death. <laughs> If you're, you want to take a death right now, are you cool with that? All right, shut up. Don't give me that shit. Yeah. I gotta give you a hard time. Uh huh. Mm. I just popped something in my neck. Owie. All right. 
Uh, do you want me to call the ambulance? Yeah, could you? Uh, yes, uh, is this a ambulance? I need a ambulance for Condor. You didn't even dial. What the fuck? I don't think you're telling the truth. No, fuck it. I'm talking one of these ugly motherfuckers. Okay. Their mom says they're cool. Uh, their mom has bad taste. Are they samurai? They're dead. Uh, so, oh, which one was it? These three? It's four. So four? Yeah. Do you have anything that pushes them over onto the other one? No? Okay. So yeah, one's dead, unfortunately. It's only one. One's better than none. All right. Now, uh, well, let's see. You move. That's so uh, you have one more action. I'm gonna fuck the other one up. Okay. Um, you do. He's dead. Take your prize. I got so much fucking money, but no I fucking like, place to spend it. I like how these it are at. max eight, but we've been mostly getting the max four guys. All right, um, play night. Play night's gonna attack the liquid samurai. Damn. Uh, actually, no. I. I'm gonna use the spider scythe and I'm gonna attack uh, all three of them. So I get an attack of three. So this attack is going to be on all three enemies in that line. That'll do. So th three. So two damage here. So I'll put two damage here. Um, he's dead. So that's what four coins for those guys. Uh huh. Um, he might be dead. Four health. Uh, no, he takes two. That's a good use of the scythe. All right, I'm going to go ahead and bomb this guy. Uh, for three. Nothing, I'm going to bomb him again. Oh, should I? You know what? No, nah, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to just move. Just be safe. Oh, and of course I rolled a three. <laughs> All right. Anyways, your turn. Actually, no, no, you're, it's not your turn. Um, right? Yeah, Peg Knight goes last. Okay, so characters get blown back. Um, Mona dies. I was really trying to kill him, too. How does she die? She just gets knocked back to the other one. Yeah, I know, and then... Oh. Because technically, when that other one starts his turn, I'm technically not in his area. No, 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 you were. Hold up. Shit. God damn it. Oh, okay, I see what you, you see mean. You see what happened? Yeah, I, I fucked up sorry, moving shit before it was done, but you would have been pushed back... The guy would have went over and attacked you. Both of you would have been pushed off. This guy should have went up to here because he's the closest. Um, this guy shouldn't have even fucking been in there. God, it's all fucking stupid right now. Uh, I don't. I guess I'll just put that in here and he'll. These two will push into here, I guess. And this guy has only one health left. The flying guy has one health left. So I'll put all the damage onto Black Knight. And then... Let me do that real quick. So... Orly Bitch. 
Wow. He only has two defense uh, against a three, two. Take one and then two gold knights, which are both two each. It uh, doesn't matter, he's dead. All right, so Black Knight's dead. <sighs> all right. Um, all right, now that those have all gone, enemies, Jesus. Um, there, it's there and there. We have a skull. All right, Mona's turn. Mona goes first. Oh, you know what? God damn it, I bet we're doing this whole thing wrong. Yeah, I forgot. So this, so the way this stage works, every time you step on an ice tile, you keep moving to the end of the ice tile. I forgot about that. The stages have their own special thing. So technically moving here should have moved all the way across, but we won't do it for this game. But in the next game, we have to remember that each stage has special unique attributes that I forgot, okay. I forgot to do. But anyways, it's Mona's turn. I moved. Oh, okay. Black Knight, uh... Jesus, there's so much shit right here. I really want to kill them all, though. I'm going to move here. Get my shit back. And Black Knight's just going to go ham on him. I'm going to start with a gyrocopter, bitch. Oh, I never got my card, either. Um... Take a hair heirloom <laughs> card. <sighs> Alright. Uh, two damage. That actually does finally kill him. He only has one health left. Alright. He's finally goddamn dead. Jesus Christ. And that gives me how much? It's four. Four. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and attack the Golden Knight. Four, two. So he takes one damage. All right, your turn. Uh, digital. Oh, you moved on. You moved him off the board. Okay, so he's done. Oh, that sucks for me. Okay, um, plague knight. Um, plague knight is going to hit. Uh, he's going to spend two coins to hit all models on that space.
I will absolutely take that. Um, so this dude is super dead. He is four. And then that guy has one health left. I'll do a regular bomb. And I'll do another regular bomb. Absolutely. I'll take another four. Toss him. Toss that. Uh, and Plague, Lights, Plague Knight is done. So these characters are going to move down here and here. And do nothing. This is going to move down. <coughs> move down. Move down. It's Mona's turn. Try, bitch. Okay. Um. Actually, no. I take that back. One, two, then three. Oh, there's a wall there. I didn't see that. Okay. Wow. Oh, fuck. All right. I'm gonna move here. I'm going to attack. Actually, shit. I was attacking with the wrong set of dice last time. I should have one more die. Uh, I am going to attack the rat first. Rat dies. I get one coin for the rat. One uh, rat, one coin. Uh, I put damage on the other guy because I care because of my ability. Um, gold armor, bitch. Here we go. Uh, he takes one damage and one more attack. He's super dead. He's deader than dead can be. Yeah. Okay. Plague Knight is going to go one, two, three. And mm. end my turn. Move down. Move down. <clears throat> one, two. <clears throat> I am going to. Oh, hey, an armor. One reroll. Plus one reroll. I am actually going to. Let's see, one, two, three. So I need one, two, three, four. And I'll buy that. Wait. Mm -hmm. Wait, the fuck does the same fucking thing? There. Um, Plague Knight is going to move in here. Uh, what can a Plague Knight get? Um, I'll spend... Mm. How much does he have? Two. So I'll plan one, two, three. I'll buy the mill ticket. And then I'll spend one, two, three, four. And I'll buy the armor. With extra defense on him. Uh, I'll end my turn. One, two. One, two, move off the board. All right, now then. Now let's go, let's do the boss. Let's get this done. All right. God damn it. <laughs> Okay, he they always start there. Um we can delete all of those. We can uh actually let's keep those. So one thing I did as a fuck up is I deleted the 
Oh, he's a he's back to wild. One thing I did is kind of a fuck up is that I delete the spikes and this guy actually will create spikes and icy floors and I got rid of those on accident, not thinking I needed them. But apparently I do. So yeah. Alright. Um so he has two attack, two defense, clear all ice tiles off. All, clear all ice tiles and spike pits ice tiles off the board. Polar Knight moves to the space of the winning hero and then attacks them and all heroes in adjacent spaces. Place an ice tile on Polar Knight's new space. Lovely. So... Uh, is that where you want your two characters? I'll put him there and I'll put actually let's put let's, we'll do that and that. Alright, uh so Mona gets to go first. Does she have to be in this tide to shoot him from range? Uh, she has, yeah, she has to be one space away, and she doesn't have any equipment that says otherwise. So, yes, she has to be one space away. And my ten. All right, let's see what the boss does. Zoop. Okay, so, oh, God. Boss is going to move here and hit the area around him. But he's also going to play spikes straight down the row. Did that kill her instantly, though? Is that what that is? So the thing is, I don't have spikes, uh, so I'm going to have to improvise. I'm going to use these treasure tokens as spikes. And then for ice, let's use, um, let's use heart tokens. These are, these are ice. Oh, yeah. If I'm looking at saying it, it's only the back full. It is. Um, now, with ice, when you move on to an ice tile, you have to keep moving in that direction. Um, so you would just basically slide all the way through. So you would slide into the spikes. Um... Boss the iron rails. Polar Knight will occasionally play spike pits and ice spaces onto the board during his boss fight. The AI card will show where to place them. These are not permanent as they are removed from the board at the end of the round after the boss goes. It doesn't say. So when he pulls it. The, bo the drawn boss AI card needs both spike pit and ice cards to be placed on the board. Simply place the corresponding ice tiles onto the board. The AI card will place an existing hazard. The new hazard replaces all point nine lands on spike pit. Replace the spike pit with an ice tile. So the way I'm going to run this, um, because I don't, it doesn't explain it. I'm just going to say if it's a hero, we're not going to have a spike pit. We're going to have an ice instead. Okay. Uh, so Mona went, so it is Black Knight's turn. Black Knight is going to move one, which he's going to slide here. Two. Um, actually, you know what? Here's a, let's see, one. I'm going to do a jump, and I'm going to try to jump on the boss from here. Which is jump is two, but I get a reroll because of my armor. Reroll of one, so I get the reroll of one die. Jump. He did one. I'm going to reroll this one. Made it. So he jumped to here, and I'm going to attack for four. Fuck this piece. Fuck him up. 
I think he has, what, two armor? Yeah. And so he takes one damage, and I get uh, two. All right. It says one or two per wound. Yeah, it's two per wound. You get two coins per wound you do on the boss. Okay, we're going to pull his next card. So he's going to move up to here. Um, he damages damn near everything below him. So Mona's going to get hit. And a uh, spike is going to go right here. The new has replaces the old one. Okay, so uh, those do stay. Okay, so did you do your roll for Mona? Yep. Okay, so it's uh, your other knight's turn. Also, don't forget he can teleport. So... With the ice, if you move one spot, you're going to slide all the way over there in one action. Two actions. Three actions. Okay. Uh, Plague Knight... Actually... Uh, hmm. Yeah, let me, lock, let me lock the board down. Here. Okay. What are you going to do? See, does this count? The special move, does it actually count as a move? It counts as an action, yes. Yeah. So you'd be better off using it back here. Because if you want to teleport them to them... Uh, oh, to an unoccupied space is three spaces away. So if you were to do that, it has to be unoccupied, so you would move there. So actually, no, it probably would be better to go here than teleport... That's still an action. You you would just be standing on them. Best you could I'll do is... Wait. Yeah. Okay, you wait there? All right. Um, well, guess who's coming to say hi? Uh, Mona gets hit again. This is going to be an ice because he's standing there. And then there's going to be ice right here, which replaces the spikes. Mona died. They yep. did. Okay. Go ahead, put half your loot right there. Alrighty then. This is actually, holy shit, let's add that up real quick. Um. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Okay, that, there, that's more manageable. Okay. Um, Plague Knight's turn. Man, there ain't shit Plague Knight can do. Um, I guess I'll do a jump action, see if I can j jump. Jump is a three, so at least I got that. So I'll try to jump this pit of spikes. I made it, Jesus, barely. I'll move one, and then I'm going to move two and pick up the loot. Lady bitch. Yep. And slide to the end. Ooh, when you fall off on the map? No, not in this one. You don't fall off the map. In fact, even with the normal ice, you don't fall off the map. You just slide and, and stop. Man, fucking console is selling my loot. What a dick. Oh. The name of the game. Um. So, he gets to do his special. Clear all ice tiles and spike pits off the board. So, all of these get moved off. 
He then moves to the winning hero and then attacks him and all heroes in adjacent spaces place an ice tile in Polar Knight's new space. So how much do you have? How many coins? You beat me. I only have 15. 15? Okay. So he's going to move. He's going to move to the... Cl it says uh, in multiplayer, he's going to move to the closest. I'm actually going to put him on to... Oh, no. It would be Black Knight. Black Knight, that's going to be an ice. And he's going to attack Black Knight. Four, two. And I get four defense. No, two defense. Yeah, two defense. But I get a reroll. Uh, I will reroll. Oh, I'm good. Hydrate. This is just a threat. Right. Uh, Motor turn. back on the board. Hydrate again. Oh. Okay. So you're going to do a range attack? Yeah. I use this card to gain a success. Okay. Blow up. So I might only get two successes. You have two successes by default, so you just need anything else, because he only has two armor. So you did one damage. And I get money. You get two, yes. Big pay gets back the money you stole from me, you greedy bitch. Stop. I'm gonna hit you open like a loot goblin. Uh, Mona gets hit. And he puts spikes down here. And then he puts ice down here. It is just like the game. Like, these moves are pretty much like how he does, acts in the game, too. Um, did you roll her defenses? Yep, I Maybe. lost two. Okay. Um, I am going to jump. Wait, hmm? Plague Knight dead or alive? Oh, he's right here. He's he's. Oh no, <laughs> uh, he should be at full health. Yeah, I don't have anything to give me extra health, so he should be at full health. He hasn't been hit yet. I think that was from when he died last time. Uh, do I get? I get an extra. Yeah, I get plus one to my jump, so I have a three. So I need to try. I need to try for three dice, three ups, three ups. Got it. Holy shit! I fucking got it. Jump to him. I get attack him. I'm gonna attack him probably twice actually. You spin me right. Right round, baby. Right round like a record baby spinning. Round, round. <laughs> I will re-roll this one. Does nothing. I'm going to attack one more time. Epic fell. Two. I'm going to re-roll this one. See if I can get at least one shovel. would be nice. Nope. Nothing. All right. Um, bump. He moves to the corner, attacks here and here. So he hits Mo God, Mona's just Mona's not having a good time. Uh, that's going to go there. We need ice. Where's ice? Step up and bup. So that, that actually overwrites these spikes. Let me move some. Okay. Uh, then it's your turn. Let's see. It's my turn. Okay. Plague Knight's just going to stand there and bomb the shit out of him. Bombing time. Bombing time. 
and he gets a three. I don't have nothing. Nope, nope. Still three. Bombing time. This some bitch is gonna know what the sun nope. feels like. Nope, bombing time number two. Ooh, there we go. Uh, he takes two damage. Bombing time number three. Critical misses, so we flex it. Uh, he takes one more damage. So that's the end. So he's going to clear the board again. And go after the one who has the most money. <laughs> yeah, and Plague Knight's the closest, so he's actually going to go to Plague Knight. And he's going to turn that to ice. Um, and he's going to hit. Play At least he doesn't knock him down. That was aggravating. So Plague Knight gets three. Yeah, he gets three on his dice rolls. Oh, no, no, he doesn't. He only gets, he gets two. Hold up, he gets two. Uh, defended one of those. Okay. It is Mona's turn. Gonna use my ability. Gain two loop cards. Okay. Boom. Also remember these here are worth five at the end of the game for each one you have. FYI. As long as you don't use them up. Just the heirlooms though. Okay. And she's going to shoot this bastard. Shoot him. Two up. Uh, nope. Not with that, unfortunately. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so he's going to attack this space here. And he's going to put a spike here. Here. We'll put ice there. And then he's going to put ice literally everywhere. This son bitch likes ice, doesn't he? Yeah, he's called the polar knife for a reason. Because he's a bitch. He's a lot easier in the video game. Hmm? He's easier in the video game because he doesn't go all over the place because it's a side scroller, so he goes left to right, so it's a lot easier to dodge his shit. Um, it was Mona, so it's going to be Black Knight's turn. Oh, fuck. <sighs> Don't really have a good... Um, I guess I'll jump. I'm going to try to jump to here. So I need three. I actually got it. I actually got four. I'll spend two coins to do his dark wave ability. First time I've actually done it. So I get four attack. Uh, it doesn't count. It doesn't work. So I'm going to use two more. Which does. He takes two damage. So I actually got all my money back. And then I end my turn. So now he moves. He moves to uh, Spectre Knight and attacks. So he's going to be attacked. And then these are going to turn into Spike Pits. Man, he's in a shitty spot now. And those are still ice. Okay, they'll stay there. Deflect it like a boss. Nice. Well, it is now his turn to attack it like the boss. Since he's right there. He's gonna fuck him up. Has eight health left. 
You theoretically could almost kill him in one hit if you do. Ooh, there you go. Holy shit. So that's negated. So he took three hits on that. So you get six coins. You can just press six on your keyboard. That's what, oh, I've, been yeah. doing. That's what I've been doing. I'll, I'll push six. I'll put it all into your hand. Then I just drag it out. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Now let's see if I can get even better. Whoa. Five, yeah. Uh, nope. Defended it. Oh, there you go. There's another two. So you get another four coins. And he's going to do a special. So clear all the shit back off. Teleport you shift. stood the highest. Okay. Uh, who's closer? Is it black? Let's see, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. So he's gonna go here. Go here. He's gonna put ice down. Oh, and he's gonna also hit Mona. He's hits. He hits in a, a, around him. So he's gonna reflection hit. shield. Reflect the attack. Uh, or relic card back into the attack. So you get to attack him for his attack then. So you get to roll two attack dice against his defensive two. Uh, nothing. And then I have a defense of two. Saved one. Okay. Uh, your turn, Mona's turn. She's I shoot a, him. She's in a great spot. You could probably kill him right now. Mm, not with that. Try again. Try again. I could one shot him, you stupid. You could. You could. Uh, almost. He takes two damage. So you get four coins. You just gotta do one point of damage to him. Yeah. Uh, Black Knight's going. Oh, yeah, we gotta flip this, see what he does. Oh, yeah, that's right. So he's gonna be in the far corner. He's gonna attack there. He's gonna put. Uh, well, ice. 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 Uh, spikes. Spikes. Oh, God, she's in oh, take that one back. Um, I'm going to try jumping. I need a three. Need a three, need a three, need a three. And the dice say no. I know, right? Need a three, need a three, need a three. I got it. I got three. So jump. I'm going to spend two to use my not. That is not two. <laughs> yep. Nope. No. Nope. Damn God. No. You're going all Table, out. Tabletop sim. That is not the number two. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to try to do it from range. Oh, he has what? One health? Yep. Oh my god, here we go, here we go. Up. Uh, I got he it. He did it. I'm he's dead. He's, he's dead. He's dead. Goodbye. Hi. Hi. Yeah. Oh. Na, 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 na. Oh, this is my fur goes my five. Well. Okay, well, there we go. There we have it. That's the full game. Most almost properly played. I didn't do the ice level right, but. Oh, a little bit better that time, though, I think. <laughs> and the dice said no. I think the, um, I think that was way better than having just their two characters. Right? That was a lot better. It was a lot better, yeah. It'd be better with four players, I think, but yeah. Hydrate. This is just Hydrate. a threat. Oh, fuck. Another? All right, fine. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be it for me. I think I'm good. How about you, Digital? You good? Yeah, I'm good. What's that, Digital? You want to play it again? All right, let's go. I will. <laughs> Here we go. Let's do it again. Yay. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> if you free tomorrow, we can play it again tomorrow. Uh, maybe if I have time. I, I promised RTM I'd play some games with him and some other stuff. 
So we will see. I'm not sure. I, I, you know how it is with me. Every day is kind of random. So I try to make if I can. I think this would be more fun in person because I have the actual models and the models are really fun to look at. They're really neat. So. Oh, Die Katana Deathmatch stream. You, Nether, you should shut up. Like completely with that nonsense. Get, get out of here. Get out of my stream. Fucking Daikatana. Get out of here. You, you go play some goddamn Daikatana. But no fucking Daikatana. It is. It was. What do you mean it is, Ruby? Alright, let's. We're gonna play. We're gonna play a new game. Uh, we play. We play. Um. We play. Um. I don't know. I play Fireball Island. Let's go do it. Makes the models more satisfying. Because they're just cool to look at and they're chunky. Our uh, English start. Did you know this game here is from my childhood? None of players. What, bro? What do you want to play? Oh, I gotta click the button. That's why. This game. Oh shit, that's actually kind of cool. So, so this game has had a remake of it, and it's cool as fuck, right? Because the whole point of Fireball Island is you gotta roll fireball around, you know, and you gotta pick the fireball. Oh, you can push it and look, it rolls. And if it hits your adventurers, you die and you have to go back. Oh no, my God. This was such a big deal, guys. Place once before. Dude, this came like back when I was a kid, these type of boards where they're lifted like this were great. There's a Micro Machines one. And I loved it because you put like water and shit in. You had to go through the obstacles. It was so much fun. I loved it. And it was like this. It was like this pressed plastic. And Fire Fireball Island was the big one. Like that's the one everybody fucking played was Fireball Island. And you had to try to get the jewel and get out of the island. And um, and it would shoot the fireballs down. And I never actually played it, but they had the remake of it, which is what this game is. Dude, it sold like crazy at Gen Con. It it absolutely sold like insane. Like they 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 sold every copy. It was cool. Anyways, uh, we're going to go ahead. Let's go raid somebody because I think I'm good for the stream. <laughs> that is not the Twitch. Who's playing? Um. Let's see. You know who we haven't raided in a while? Let's go raid uh, Kobold. He's playing Pokemon U uh, Pokemon Unite. We haven't played raided Kobold in a lot. Uh, Kobold. Kobold. I, uh, damn it. I had unraided somebody. That's fine. No, dude, you raid you. It's fine. I'm going to raid if my people. For some reason, he's not showing up on my list. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Well, we'll go We'll go raid this guy. Thanks, guys, for stopping by. We're going to play Baldur's Gate on Monday. We'll do some more Baldur's Gate. I gotta think of a new game to play after um, Cyberpunk. But you guys have a good one. I'll see you away around. I'm 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 a little buzzed. I'll see you guys. Bye bye.